Genshin, but I'm ready. Uh, I'm ready. Am I? I'm ready. All right. Rowan. Very dead. Ooh. Fucking son of a bitch. He's not back yet. What the fuck? You fucking what? There he is. He's very sorry. He indeed beyond dead. Turtle himself, Barry. Is it? Wow. That's uh, oh, daddy. Maybe. Roll 20 is working. Indeed so. beyond is dead, yes. No, what do you mean? Defunct website's gone. gone it mine appears to be working completely fine. I but... don't know my spells. So if D&D Beyond's down, I am... Oh, characters are down. And yeah, character down. sheets down. That's fine. Uh, well, uh, oh. mine, my, mine's in fucking Ginkgo Bastards. Roll, so. roll 20. Yeah, let's mm. go. Oh god, I forgot, I forgot how humongous this map was. Jesus fuck. <laughs> mm -hmm. This map is cool. As well. Holy shit. Yeah, it's very high res. Hey, Ron, you've not seen this, I don't think, right? No, I haven't. It's probably summarised what's happened for the last... How many have you missed? Two in a row? Two, yeah. Why are there four Two. explosions in the corner? Ignore them. They're for okay. later. I just can't have them off the screen, and I can't be asked to find them later on, so I'm going to leave them up there. Oh, okay. You also, Will, do you want to have a little spoiler? No one else look at the top right. We'll look at this. Uh, uh. What am I looking at? Top right? Did you see it? Oh. You said no one else looked? Yeah, no one else looked. Okay. Yeah, that... didn't see a thing. Nice, good, I'm glad. Uh... I'm trying to think what I've been having in the last two weeks. I mean, you weren't there for meeting Grit, unfortunately. No. Grit was an interesting character, I feel. Um... You would have liked Grit. Yeah, you would have really liked Grit, I think. You'd have gone swimmingly, I think. Um... Yeah. Oh, yeah. You and Grit in real life are very... Very similar. Hovis's brother, <laughs> have we met? Yeah, he met another. Uh, well, they don't. He doesn't know who Hovis is, mate. He could probably oh. imply from the name, but met another big lady. A big lady. Mm. Uh, yeah, you found a village that had been wiped out. You then you all went to town, and you were canonically uh, in the wagon shitting yourself the entire time uh, <laughs> with sewer plague. You're a fucking um, new man, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Ten kilos lighter. Yes. <laughs> you're a... oh, I can see uh, I can see Jim on the map now. Nice. Be your name on there. Oh, thanks, Hop. Nice. Oh. You know, everyone can put themselves somewhere on the map, should they wish. Uh, I was going to say, probably not oh. in the arena if we've had a slap. Yeah, you meant to have been sleeping somewhat, so... <clears throat> Will... Oh, Will uh, founded a sex cult. I did. Mm. Oh, that's that's a sex sex cult. Cult. And I still a haven't come up with an interesting name for it. So yeah, yeah. What did we call it last time? A completely polygamy cult one or something? Uh, it was poly. It, it was polyfuckers. Polyfuckers, the cult of the polyfuckers. Yeah. yeah. With uh, silver poly adventures. Yeah, you got. I introduced an entire thing that I'll probably never use, about being a certain rank of adventurers to get out of legal trouble. And Maybe we that'll come in handy. To the as uh, uh, the bad guys, the the uh, as uh, uh, apostates. Yeah, 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 I name dropped the apostates, but you only met one. No, two actually. And then you were challenged to. We fought one in Mortal Kombat, and uh, every time we hit him with damage, he grew more resistant to that type of damage. That was rough. Which you know. It's like you substituted your main damage dealer in Finney for Rowan, your main damage sponge. Mm. Uh, mm. Could be a good trade, who knows? Um, I guess yeah, we'll find out. I'm the main damage dealer at this point. Yeah, true. <laughs> oh, it's back up. No, that was easy. Character sheets now work. Yeah, I, I'm on mine, absolutely fine. Yeah, it wasn't working. Oh, I will say that I'm losing people's characters very quickly in this fucking city, dear lord. <laughs> yeah, I went to... That's gonna be well, I mean, it's not exactly to, to scale, bridge. so... No. <laughs> we're kaiju. Well, maybe it is. Fine, maybe it's just a really small <laughs> thing. <laughs> yeah, we're kaiju. Yeah, but... Yes. That's the entire point of the game. You're going to become great spirits. This is your first experience, is it, boys? Alright. Uh, are we ready to go? Let's get rid of Bunghole. Okay. Uh, yeah, so to super summarize the last two sessions for you, Rowan. You met an apostate. Videos. 
Or watch the videos. Only one is up currently. So. Uh, I think the other one has no sound, so I'm probably not going to upload that. Uh, really? The most recent one? The most recent one is up is uploaded, I believe. No, it wasn't. The most recent upload for this one is from 11 days ago, from this campaign. Oh, I was watching it last night. To oh, remind myself. right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got you, got you. I didn't upload it. <laughs> A peeper. Oh, well. Uh... Anyway, yeah, so you can watch them once they're up, or I'll remind you now, in which case I'll do it now. You fought a member of the apostate, Grit, who's a, yeah, a damaged man, he enjoys being damaged. Uh, and then you visited the Is city. Is that why we're similar? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Horny for the damage, my guy. Horny for the damage. Um, and then you visited the city, you were in a wagon shitting yourself the entire time. The rest of the party became ranked adventurers, silver ranked at that, so they're quite impressive. Uh, they fought some monsters that were higher rated than they should have been able to beat, but they beat them quite easily, so I should keep that in mind when I'm balancing things in the future. Smile. Uh, ben and Rian failed to do some puzzles miserably. That was entertaining. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, but yeah. beat the fuck out of that guy. Yeah, you did beat the fuck out of that guy. Uh, and then you were challenged by another member of the okay, apostate, so at which point right. you were like, lol, nah, we'll see you tomorrow, and went to sleep. Uh, and yeah, we'll, we'll die. Oboe could sense the approach of uh, Borond, for sure. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and in mm -hmm. fact, rolled me a dice to determine how long they would have until mm -hmm. Borond appeared. Did I? If you remember, you did. I didn't did tell you what, you, what yeah, you were rolling yeah, for, yeah, yeah, but yeah. I got you to roll the dice, and you did roll it. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I so don't you, know how Oboe's going to react to this. Now you've got a backstory. Uh, yeah, isn't it? It's uh, it works. What the fuck is this? So, so yeah. I would say you guys have all woken up. Um, you've come down uh up from the inn's second floor, where all the beds are, to the main meeting room. Uh, you've you've left the room outside to the fountain. Uh, Barry's rolled out of his shit-filled wagon and cleaned himself off in the fountain like the absolute savage that he is. Um, luckily, this is where Will committed his first sin of making a polyfucker cult. It's a semen-filled fountain. So it's it's a pretty grubby fountain anyway, so you've not done much to disturb it, truth be told. You may even be grubbier and full of STDs now, Ron. so good job, good luck. Jesus. Yep. No, uh, the court has a very uh, anti-STD policy. Everyone is tested first. <laughs> that is very enlightened. Uh, good job, Will. Yeah, no problem. Prepared for any occurrence. I mean, if I send you this... Mm -hmm. um... Yep. Um, no, I don't send it now, actually, it's fine. It's irrelevant for now. Uh, Rianne, you can send this bar and approaching. Mm -hmm. Please elaborate that to the party. In terms of? Obo oh, can sense bar and approaching. Uh, you've all felt the rumbles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You need to discuss with the party. Uh, this is happening and go from there. Hello, the boys. Hello. Um, we're not nervous about me. Uh, but I have quite literally looked the great spirit of death um, in his enormous mouth cavity uh, <laughs> and lived to tell the tale. Um, Shit. What's their uvula look like? Uh, spiky. Okay. Uh, covered in sand. Um, Oof. <laughs> yeah, gonna, that'd be that's going to be uncomfortable, yeah. Um, yeah, um... I think that may be the source of his murder problem, yeah. Um... <laughs> yeah that's Sandy Uvula, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think the best way forward is to just clean his uvula for him. Um, Alright, I'm up for that. And he might chill out a little bit. We're going to need a really, really big, like, quarter staff size Q-tip. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so sorry, I'm just opening my backstory so I can elaborate. Um... Let's have a gander. Yeah, this this is... Uh, oh, they're just pulling out a book and reading their history. <laughs> my life's purpose, uh, as one would say. Um, we are very much linked 
He has seen into my soul. I have seen into his. And uh, now he's coming here. Um, I don't know if he seeks me specifically. Should he be seeking you? Well, I've sent you a, a little thing that I wrote last night that has got a hint in there. Um, something you, you would be aware of in character. What did you do to this guy that makes well, you think he's coming for you? My intention was to kill him. Uh huh. Indirectly, I would say, um, killed my family. Nice, nice. Um, Your poor cabbage farming family. My cabbage farming family. Yes, yes, yes. My um, lovely orc mommy and my, I shouldn't say mommy, should I? Mother. <laughs> and my, now, uh, no going back. <laughs> wonderful bard mother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No references to anything else. Um, no relation. Destroyed the cabbage farm. Um, that's that's rough. Yeah, the cabbages is okay? The cabbages were not okay. Um, <sighs> um, the cabbages were not okay at all. They were... They were all gone. There was a single leaf left, actually, of one of the cabbages. And, uh, oh, no. I can carry it with me to this day. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you can't really make costs law with that. Fucking hell. Yeah, it's well, old. It's you, old. you occasionally use it as a mask for uh, masquerade. Uh, yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. I was inspired by a story <laughs> that my uh, mother told me once. So uh, maybe that'll come up at some point. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, so I looked into his eyes and I, uh, you know, looked into the abyss, saw the uh, the eldritch, the eldritch horror of Borund, and uh, and walked away. Um, but I have vowed to um, seek him out, return, destroy him. That kicked his ass. So maybe he. Yeah, that doesn't sound very sensible if you killed your whole family. Well, it feels like you'd want to run away from the guy, surely. <clears throat> I had a an awakening. I um I saw I saw all uh -huh. looking okay. at his giant sandy hue feeler. Um Is it made of sand or just dirty? It's just dirty. Uh, okay. It's made of like uh otherworldly horrible spiky flesh, Ooh. I would say. Ooh. It's just Embedded with years and years and years of um, open mouth, you know, desert tunneling <laughs> um, <clears throat> sand. So it must be pretty uncomfortable. And he's a bastard. Can, can you can you describe him at all? Uh, uh, um, <laughs> he's very large, uh, uh -huh. worm shaped, uh, a worm, in fact, some would say. <laughs> uh, the a worm that lives in the desert that's very big. I do, you know, it's not reductive at all. Never. Uh, <laughs> there you go, Ryan. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, he's freaky looking. <laughs> so I'm just trying to read what Tom has written and also speak. <laughs> Don't worry about the the written bit. Isn't it's just something <laughs> to keep in mind. Uh... <clears throat> Okay, okay, okay. Ah, okay. Good choice. So yeah, he comes here. And I do not know his purpose, but I'm sure we're going to find out. Da -da -da. Mm. That doesn't bode well. It doesn't bode great. Not for the it does living. not bode well. It does not bode well. And you guys are also aware that the, the apostates are in the city. Uh, for an unknown reason. Could certainly be related. I will say that the um, for yeah. some reason I've gone onto my D&D Beyond and Oboe seems to be in death saving throws, so maybe this has thrown off kilter so much. Oboe, <laughs> 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 uh, Oboe, shit, are you okay? <laughs> yeah, still a long rest, you'll be fine. 30 psychic damage just from being in the area. <laughs> could like just leave we tried no, that at the other village yeah. very much like to see him what? Oh, you want okay. to mm. mm. see the the demon of death I thing like the big worm demon of death absolutely 
Okay. Who killed we'll the entire family? We'll um, have fun with that. Yeah. yeah. I, for one, would like to avoid the big worm of death. I'd say in some ways we are one in the same. You think you're a big worm of death? I, yes. Yes, yes, yes. And, and what makes you think that? We, you know, we've, we've, um, what, what would be the, the correct way of phrasing it? We've swapped, um, soul spit. Oof. What? It's, you know, he's looked into me, I've looked into him. Ah. Uh, I okay. saw, he's been you know, in visions, you. Okay. I saw visions of infinite life and death. Uh, We've all had that one. All yeah. of humanity all at once. It was a bad trip. Um, <laughs> and he saw uh, a cabbage farmer's daughter. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> I mean, it was a great trade. Yeah, I'm sure he will be seeking me out as much as I, I can am see why he would want to kill you out. now. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> He gave you a look into death itself, and in return, <laughs> you, you got to see a cabbage farming <laughs> Okay, right. Hmm. I'm seeing and, now. And, where... and he said in his booming voice, "Big lady." <laughs> <laughs> Which is impressive because he's quite a lot bigger than you. From well, the sound of his uvula as well, so it would be quite it, hard to enunciate that. It, it turns out his uh, first name is Boron, and his surname is actually Hovis. Weirdly enough, <laughs> that, is, that is strange. I mean, we we met a Hovis in the other city as well, so I mean, it makes sense if there's just another out there, you know. Yeah, there's always three, right? Exactly. Okay, so so so, what's the plan, adventurers? Um, you were right. tasked by the Adventurers Guild to uh, at least attempt to hunt down the apostates and stop the. What they assume is something to do with a ritual summoning Borond or something. They know they're doing something. Right. Do I'm, I'm going to talk to Vincenzo Tinkledo Tinkletoes. Um. Hello. Do we do we know of any rituals as as mages? Do we know how to like what kind of ritual would they be doing? How would some kind of summoning ritual? I imagine. Yeah, they they usually use circles. Let me let me pull out the map of this city real quick. Yeah, it's just mm. circles, huh? Yeah, because you gotta have points, surely. Like big old mm. spikes. How many and points wounds. on a circle? There's an oh, infinite all right, number all right. of points on a circle, surely. Yeah, that's too many. Um, yeah. Could it involve sacrifice? Well, if they. They, they're planning to kill people. They've, they've already murdered that whole village for seemingly no purpose. What, what if they, uh, they? I'm no, I'm no necromancer, but what if they come in here to I kill mean, a bunch yeah. of people to summon the summon him? That's true. That's true. I I would have imagined the arena as like if imagine I'm just going to draw all over this map uh, quickly. Just like if, can you imagine like freaking. <clears throat> Ah, yes, it's the Star of David. Oh, we're doing Jewish conspiracy theories. I just didn't want to draw a pentagram. Oh, shit, there's two towers right here. Oh, God. What if he came from the sky? What if there was a second one? No, yeah, I, I think. Uh, start, and I've drawn a triangle. So I see what you mean about the uh, the circle thing. The arena what could if, be uh, important. I, I have got like two towers here and a pentagon right next to it. To be fair. Oh no! As it so oh. happens, like oh, one tower, right. two tower, pentagon. <laughs> <laughs> Where's this? Sorry, can we? Uh... I'm picking. There you go. Look, oh, ping, so, sorry, I was ping. very zoomed in somewhere else. Oh, that's so, fair. Like, yeah. If we have, if we have, the... I stole this map to be clear. So. <laughs> Yeah, I, do. Mm, I don't know because if we have this and then you turn turn sideways like to your left it's a sad face Ah. so I think that, that might be a sign I think it's going to happen on the other eye 
Oh my gosh, please. <laughs> <laughs> the wing the wing dings curse. <laughs> what? Oh my god. <clears throat> Oh my god, what the fuck? That's... Wow. Thanks for that, Barry. Yeah, thanks for that, Barry. You're welcome. That's it. If you type that into Word and put it in Wingdings, that's what you get. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, man. <laughs> what does it I, mean? I, I now know something that I didn't need to know, but I can keep an eye out for in random situations. <laughs> New York, mate. Q Q thirty three. We all know what that means for New York. There, yeah. They love it there. I'm sorry. What, what does Q thirty three mean? Yeah, we that's, that's the that font. Means. That, that yeah. font. Oh, um, okay, okay. The Wingdings font, apparently. Q thirty three is quarter thirty three. Quarter three. Because um, quarter three is September. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So and three times three is nine. Yeah. Right. Plus two threes is eleven. Right? Uh, like, <laughs> what the fuck? Q, Q is the 11th letter, almost. Yeah, right. Yeah. Stop getting yourself on a fucking watch list. <laughs> 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 I mean, Bruin already is 100% anyway, but. I'm a I had to for this, but I yeah. can't find it. You've got yeah. something for this. Yeah, if I find my 9-11 meme, I'll post it later, don't worry. Uh, Excellent. I, 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 I look forward to it. <laughs> <But> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> moving on swiftly. <laughs> oh, dear. The apostate are loose in the city, boys. Okay. Bastards. How dare they? Where are they? And where can we go to avoid them? Mm. Well, we've been challenged by one of them, and we kind of ish volunteered we, we, to do oh it. Oh yeah, we kind of said, uh, you know, we'll catch you tomorrow when we've had a rest. <laughs> yeah. And surprisingly, they agreed. So it'd be kind of rude to like not actually turn up. Who mm. we fated? Ah, uh, yeah. One of the apostates kind of rode into the arena, like in a big, I don't know, cloud of fire, and um challenged us and i basically said uh come come catch us tomorrow because we we're a little uh a little tired you know <clears throat> which for whatever reason they agreed to yeah it's a bit odd hmm. well barry you're uh after having shit yourself for multiple days repeatedly you probably need to get some food right i'm full I'm starving. Where can I fucking eat around here? Look at you, Baron de Hovis is on his way, so... <laughs> 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 so I can eat him, is what you're saying? Yeah, he's a right meal worm, I heard. Hey! Oh God. <laughs> uh, okay, I, I, wonder, I wonder aimlessly, looking for some indication of where I might find food. Yeah. I have some bread. I have some of Mr. Hobus's bread. Oh, please, Lou. I'll, I'll, like I'll buy it off you. Bread? I'm trying to remember what bread it was. I think it was like a nice sourdough or something. It was baguette, remember? Oh, my God, oh, yes, baguette. baguette. It was baguette, yes. Yeah, I'll, I'll break off half of my baguette and uh, offer it to Barry. Thank you. In in two two year old goblin because I'm trying to make friends. Uh, I say, Ankishan, <laughs> <laughs> and then me and then that are you. Yeah, but Opo is fluent in goblin, so yes, yes, yes. Yeah, some kind of message. Not that should across, be able I'm to sure. prove it right now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but she is. All right, so the party is meandering around, watching Rowan meander around, attempt to get food, and then remember that his party members do have food and can give him food, I guess. Uh, you've eaten uh, the entire baguette, actually, Rowan. 
you've eaten the entire thing. It's some of the best bread you've ever have ever had. Half the baguette. No, he ate the entire thing. Yeah, sorry. You greedy fucker. You gave him half, and then he just stole the rest when you weren't looking. How much to remember, Mister Hobbit? You can always go buy some more. Yeah, I suppose so. <clears throat> and you could maybe explore the city and see if you can talk to some locals who may have interacted with some deviants. You know, there's some naughty people in Bouts. You could, uh, you could do a lot. I'm opening up the city, boys. You do you. We need to find well, signs of the, the other uh, states, right? What's the EPA on the... Uh, Would be a good sign. Do you remember the dice that you rolled? I remember rolling a dice. Mm-hmm. I don't remember what the result of the dice roll was. Then I guess you don't know. Wonderful. <laughs> I, I will inform you when it is getting close to the time. Okay. Just, okay. just out of interest, um, Obo. Yeah. Do you know which direction he's coming from? Um, Can you get a sense of that? You did. I, I sensed a rumble in the jungle. It was... In the jungle? Which way is the jungle from here? Um, just Northeast. Uh, Northeast. Just oh, north okay, east, cool. The east end of this river, yeah. Is that where this plane is? Um, if that's northeast, ne- never. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I've got some, uh, you know, nice yeah. fiery explosions to go on that no, plane, no, to be fair. The plane is borrowed. Borrowed is the plane. Okay, well, um, <clears throat> do you think we could convince maybe a wizard or two to put up, like, so, sorry, I, I mean, obviously I could, I could find a wizard that can but, uh, put up a wall and or wizard. help out. Another wizard, another, another wizard. You, yes, of course, yes, of course. obviously, to help, to assist me. Yes, yes. Um. We could go back to the Adventurers Guild and see if we can hire together any um any of those guys. Yeah. Now that we are silver tier members. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I hear that's pretty good. I hear the average is like bronze. Yeah. Paris. How do I get silver? <laughs> there you go. Yeah, over there. Yeah, Barry's across the way, splashing in a pond currently. I am. I'm a nice. <laughs> <I'm a> turtle. <laughs> <laughs> Naturally gravitate towards a pond. And yeah, he it. ran that over the river, across yeah, the bridge, to jump into a pond. The nice big river. <laughs> Ignored that. <laughs> Charmed the pond. Got the nice standing water. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Barry's, of course, afraid of fast flowing water, so. <laughs> His time in the sewage, I've told him it's a terrible idea to be in fast flowing sewage, of course. Yeah, All right, so um, it's... I'll feel clean again one day. <laughs> Someday. You have still got a sewer plague, by the way. Yeah, yeah I think you've got rolled for it. Poor Barry. Yeah. All right, um, so you're heading back towards the Adventurous Guild by Sounds of It. Is the guild situated within the arena? The guild is not. The guild is, if you zoom out, I'm going to ping here. This would be the guild. Bing, 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 bing. So far away. <laughs> yes, it is quite far away from the arena and the, the smut fountain. But we've unlocked fast travel, right? We've been there before. Mm. So. Oh, oh, yeah, of course. The, uh, can, I, can we check on how, how are the, the sex cult doing? Are they still around the fountain? Yeah, they're still. They, you know, the entire time you were talking and eating your food and like demolishing that baguette run, the sex cult was just watching you with like insane lust. I haven't uh, given the the stop signal yet, so they just keep going. Yeah, they they, they just they've been <laughs> at it all fucking night. They, they occasionally nice. pass out, um, but they've been taking pills to make sure they're still ready to go at a moment's notice, even when passed out. Mm-hmm. Are, are these Champions. pills available to the general public? Uh, they are five gold each. <laughs> they asked the cult master. <laughs> He's making you, a killing. Uh, and you have to sign a waiver as well. I do have some mysterious potions in my inventory. You do, don't you? Uh, yeah. You have at least one potion of gobbledygook that I'm aware yeah, of. So. I imagine it's just going to make my character speak like uh, I do in real life. Uh, or whoever <laughs> takes it, yes. You'd be quite accurate in that, weirdly enough. <laughs> Right, so like you... the opposite of uh, 
like speaking to anyone, it's speaking to no one. Yeah, you just start fucking scatting at people. I would like to give it to another party member and get a good impression of uh, me, actually, so that'd be good. Yes, I think it could be a good good old time, potentially. <laughs> I'm sure someone's getting spiked at some point. <laughs> uh, Alright, so you make your way back to the Adventurers Guild. Uh, it is a hive of activity Ooh. as they, you know, uh, attempt to uh, keep calm, but also try and seek out some of the naughtiest boys in Ginka. Um as a few other ventures have reported feeling a rumbling in the ground as well. Can I... Is there like a, a stage or like a, a chair or anything that I could stand on to uh, make an announcement? I suppose I'm quite tall already. You're already taller than most, so you certainly <laughs> could just shout loudly. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure I could do that. Uh, I'd like to uh, speak to the adventurers of the guild Yep. Uh, and warn them that uh, Borund, the rumblings, Abhorrent. Right. Uh, as you say this, a uh, a calm is cast over the room by your words. People uh, begin to uh, visibly pale and sweat and, and get quite nervous, you'd say. Um, you've probably not done much to help the, the, the general panic, I would say, that was in the air um, overall. Mm. Uh, Someone's going to shout, how, how do you know that? How would uh, you know? I, I've had a run-in with the Great Spirit before. Uh, and I can now sense, sense his presence uh, due to... Uh, oh, my God. Due to the events of that 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 day. Uh, <clears throat> and it is him coming. Wow. You hear oh, whispered in the crowd. Wow. Brave big lady. Wow. <laughs> um, all right, and then the guild master will step out of the room he was in. And he will urge everyone uh, to seek out the apostates as they must be stopped. Unless the Great Spirit Borund wouldn't, not unless they were somehow causing it. Uh, he believes they are on the other side of the river. In... Well, yeah, they're going to be in the arena. They're waiting for. Um, they're waiting for some hearty adventurers. Um... You would say the arena is on the other side of the river, Jim. Yeah, we're not on the right hand side of the river now. Oh, with that, uh... Yeah. You're thinking of the, the Twin Towers and the Pentagon, right? Yeah. Yeah, uh, I was thinking of the actual arena, because I thought that was where they said they'd be seeing us. Now, one of them did, yes. The Flash. <clears throat> uh, but, the yeah, the Adventure Guild Masterman mm -hmm. uh, urges for calm, but also urges for urgency, as they, they do need to be stopped. Uh, the Great Spirit Borund visiting a city would be a apocalyptic mm. event. Innumerable. Uh, as I'm sure Oboe oh. could imagine. Oh. Uh, but he's had uh, reports of people disappearing on the opposite side of the mm. river. Mm. We should get over there then. Mm. Potentially. I yes. think we must... Destroy the and prevent this calamity. He doesn't know. There have been multiple disappearances. So that's why he's urging you adventurers to go find out. Right. Cool. So he uh, gets like more a, evidence. Uh, gathering of people, like a, a mm. market or whatever, and ask around. Do we split up and search for clues? That's uh, not split up. <laughs> Let's stay together and search for clues. Yeah, so you can certainly visit the opposite side of the city. Let's go. So it's a very middle class area. Lots of trees, lots of uh, green thoroughfares, lots of uh, open green space in general. Bigger houses. 
you know, middle class for sure. There's a nice public park where Rowan has already acquainted himself with, with the public pond. And there's also the uh, CIA's main office as well, the Pentagon as it's known, and two large towers that reside next to it. Mm. Prime candidates, you'd imagine. Uh, I can see you've been so impressive. Right? Nobody would do such a thing. No, no. I was going to have orc suicide bombers at some point, to be fair. So, but I didn't know how to implement them very well. Um, we'll see. Maybe they'll maybe they'll return. Do we ping where Vincenzo's? Yes. Ping, ping, okay. ping. Uh, to be honest, we can kind of just have maybe Vincenzo as just the face of the party over there, not be the entire party over there, mm. uh, just to keep it manageable. Because uh, you don't all need to be everywhere. I'm, I'm assuming you're all sticking together. Yes. And then you can move off your characters should you choose to split. Oh, we'll see. So it's the Pentagon. Yeah, you can certainly uh, go and speak to people at the Pentagon. They're probably not going to let you in, to be honest. You are mere silver rank adventurers. Um, but there is a rather large crowd forming outside the gates. Hey there, anyone uh, heard of people going missing or anything? Uh, yeah, multiple people turn around and, uh, you know, begin to offer you their stories. There's been apparently someone's husband uh, just disappeared in the night. No warning, he was there, and then all of a sudden he was just gone. Um, someone's wife became uncontrollably angry. Uh, attacked them and then ran out the building uh, almost in fear immediately afterwards uh, there's been a variety of weird events in general um, but most people have simply just disappeared with uh, not a trace remaining Obo, do you uh, know of any of this happening before uh, before your cabbages got sadly uh, snuffed? I was uh, not in the village. Shit. I was a wandering. I was wandering. Um, and no reports can be collected because they all died. Mm. That's uh, a shame. Mm -hmm. And I had written my backstory in anticipation. <laughs> 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 They did work these enemy after uh, this. It was quite nicely, mate. Yeah, well, we'd, we'd discussed it before. Haven't we? well, yeah. The you and your eldritch horrors. Yes, yes. Um, yeah, so people tend to be saying that they've disappeared um, all over this part of town. No, in particular, it seems to be a, a wide array of people disappearing. Now, however, at least one person says that they saw a black and white striped lady um, striding through an empty house. Uh, where's the location of the empty house? Uh, no, no. She's naked. She is a... Okay. Yes. Uh, and when I say through, I mean uh, quite literally through a house. Oh. Uh, does this, did she do that last week? Yes, the Lime is a character you're aware of. Hmm. Um, she's the one that is a, in, an unstoppable force and an immovable object at the same time. Right. Yes. She's not just an art student. <laughs> uh, you could probably ask yourself, should you meet her? Uh, she's, a Barry. she's a Twitch streamer who's a body painter. <laughs> but, uh, uh, to my get her favorite. out of TOS. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and all of a sudden, I think it's probably about time. You hear a series of explosions northwards of you. Shizzle. Uh, and a large cloud of smoke appears uh, northwards. Uh, so you begin to get hints that the well, apostates might be about. I think that's the place to be, lads. Yep. And straight towards danger. Explosion. Yep. Oh, uh, as you can probably see northwards of you, Ben, there is a couple of different fires. Fire! 
Oh, yeah, so you can see multiple houses have been uh, completely engulfed in a blaze. Uh, and a few houses nearby, each of those are going to be also on fire. But they, they mainly, mainly one house in particular has just been absolutely fucking obliterated. Mm. Uh, and in the street next to it, you can see a couple of people that are appeared to be f- fighting to the death. Each other. Jesus. Yeah, just two people just absolutely fucking going at it. Sicko mode. Cool. Uh, just swinging. One of them's actually already, it looks to be pretty much dead, and the other one is just repeatedly hitting them in the head. They will not stop. Uh, screaming in anger. That's not very Christmassy. Hmm. Huh. From the spirit of yeah, go and try and break it up. Let's intervene. Uh, all right. So you uh, explain to me how you intervene. Uh, I I put my I put my body in between in between the the person's getting grounded and pounded and the ground and pounder. All right. They continue um, to swing. They just swing at you instead. Hey, <laughs> oh, hey, shit. hey. Take it easy uh, there, asshole. <laughs> hey, fucking hell. Uh, I, I whack my magical uh, levitating shield out um, <laughs> and put it in front of me and then re- <laughs> and then retreat into <laughs> into my shell. Yeah, uh, all right. They, they continue to swing. Uh, and the people that are currently looking at this, uh, you can see their fists and wrists begin to actually mangle and break as they continue to swing repeatedly at these hard objects. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, they are really going at it, and they're still screaming in anger throughout. What uh, the red face. fuck is going on, lads? Fucking, I just bulging. tried to break up a fucking bar fight. <laughs> this isn't a fucking bar fight. Can I try and charm person on these on one of these assholes? Uh, yes, I assume the guy that's currently conscious. Yeah, the one that's doing the beating. Uh, so, so wisdom save of fifteen. Thirteen. All right, that person that's is charmed. Good. All right, uh, they. I mean, uh, how does charmed work? It means they they consider you to be an ally, I believe. Uh, charmed creature regards you as a friendly acquaintance. Yeah. Hey uh, there, they continue... hey there, G- guy, come here. They continue to swing at, at Barry. They, they keep, keep hey, swinging. Hey, he's our friend. He's our friend. That guy's our friend. What are you doing? Well, I don't think he's going to think Barry's his friend, right? If you've charmed him, so he's not going to attack you, potentially. All right, all right, all right. I'll, I'll stand. I'll get in between him and Barry. I'm like, hey, buddy, buddy, it's me. All right, you begin to see a, a faint glimmer of uh, sentience come back into his eyes. Yeah, there, mate. What's uh, going on? And then it begins to dawn upon him just what he's done to his his arms and hands. Dude. And as he begins to break down in pain and, and cry, he just goes, "Ah, oh, I don't even know who that is." Ah. Oh, yeah. What's What's the deal? I was bro? just so angry. Yeah, why? Uh, chill, chill your beans. I don't, I don't even know. Oh my god, I, I need a doctor. Yeah, we'll get you to one. What um, what what made what happened before before you started fighting? I was just walking home, uh, my shopping. Uh, and all of a sudden, I just felt this rage take over me, and I just started swinging, man. Is there anyone nearby? Uh, so the people they're like in the vicinity. Um. It's weird. There's, there's like a, a real wide range of emotions in the crowd nearby, uh, but none of them really seem to be focused on this person. So one of the people is just curled up into a ball, uh, and they are just like catatonic. So as you look around, you can see that they are just like they're not. They're still there. They're still alive. They're still conscious. They're just like so sad they can barely function. Shit. Uh, some someone else is just extreme emotions over here. Yeah, someone else is just hysterically laughing. You know, just pure, pure, pure joy, pure happiness. It, it, it kind of runs the gamut, like everything. I felt like we had some kind of. I felt like I knew a spell that could calm all these people, calm all their emotions, but I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, aware that, that of, is... I'm aware of the spell, I just don't have it. 
Yeah, I mean, they all appear to have had their emotions uh, affected to an extreme yeah. degree. Um, uh, at which point, Vincenzo, you uh, begin to feel, uh, let, let's say, sadness oh, creep God. over you. So I'm going to need a, a wisdom saving throw, please. All right. Uh, Vinny sheet, Vinny sheet. Uh, wisdom. What is this? Saving throws on this sheet? I don't know. I'm just D&D beyond it. Oh, God, I've got so many things over here. <sighs> D20, uh, natural 20. Natural 20. Nice. Uh, cool. You brush it off. You don't even huh. know nor care. Uh, you can sad s- for a second there, boys. You can sense that the uh, emotion, that the way that you're being affected, you kind of sense, you say it's more, uh, let's say, southeast than it would be any other direction. Hmm. Uh, it's not super precise. Something's but controlling you're aware. these emotions, guys, and it feels southeast. South Oaky. east yeah. is this Someone way. You can get. This way. Could be somewhere. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. But you, you can also see that there are quite a few houses on fire, and, and there's some people <laughs> that are run, running out of them. Uh, mm. Not in the happiest state. Um, one of them runs out and they go, "They've got my baby! Please, they, they took my baby." Who? Who? That's a woman. It's she fine. Will... Just make another one. Uh, she will dis her nice. <laughs> She'll slap <laughs> the fuck out of his immediately. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so. Does anyone yeah. anyone have like? Fire put out spells or water spells or something. Uh, or have a bucket, wizard. you know. Uh, I have uh, my cantrip. Uh, I'm sure I have a cantrip. But it's a it small seems like fire. an interesting, to be honest. Prestidigitation can snuff out a small campfire. So, yeah. uh, as I established, this house is like. In a blazing oh. inferno. Is there any? Yeah. Like, is there like a water or a fire or a hose or something? I mean, there's a river right here. You could probably okay. uh, organize a, a human chain, potentially. Oh, that's a lot of fucking effort right there. Let's um, do it, boys. People, yeah. gather around. Get some buckets. Put these fucking houses out. Uh, the crowd continues to just exhibit extreme emotions. Shit. All right, these guys are useless. We need to stop this. These, the control <clears throat> Yeah, their emotions are being controlled. Well, um, I, felt I, have, for I, a, I felt it for a second, <laughs> but I was able to withstand it um because if we don't i fear the whole city might be in the same situation yeah exactly then we'll have fucking chaos on our hands this guy was about to beat this fucker to death um i was like oh just, by the way mate, and uh, where's, you, where's your house mate the, yeah. the guy uh he's gonna say it is just over here he lives i'm pinging it on the map here all right so go away. go uh, he, home. He gets out through the snobs. I want you to go home, lock the door. You don't lock the door, man. My hands are fucked. Okay, oh my okay, god. Yeah. I'll, I'll, tell you what, I'll do it for you. So um we'll take him home. Yep. Um can we uh, has everyone got a cantrip that can heal? Just don't want to waste a spell. Uh no. No. I have poison spray. Yeah, that might work. <laughs> it, might, it might help. <laughs> you know what? Mm. I am going to... I can to... put him to sleep. <laughs> nah, be right. Yeah, do uh, that. He, he could just go to the hospital. He knows where the hospital is. Okay, yeah, you so could go to the hospital doctor. and tell them to uh, give you like a, a potion of anesthesia when they operate on, on you. That way it won't hurt so much, right? Okay, mister. I'm, I'm oh my god. Uh, he's right, going to... I can fuck off. Like, hobble off into the distance with his fucked hands. Yeah, what an idiot. Angry, angry man. Yeah, well. Alright, I th- we need to head southeast, boys. Yes? Yeah, um, I think so. You're... Yeah, absolutely. Cool. Let's right. head southeast.
You spoke next, Obo. Give me a wisdom saving throw. Shit. Okay. Oh, I've got plus five to that. Seven. <laughs> seven. <laughs> okay. That's a nice, nice little. Ah, hmm. All right, Ria. Uh, you all of a sudden uh-huh. just feel incredibly afraid. Okay. Um. Like, it is an unnatural feeling, for sure. But you feel it nonetheless. You're All of a sudden, you are terrified. Mm. Um, is it fear anything... I've felt before? No. It's okay. just... I mean, I don't know. Has your character ever just been... Just felt nothing but fear? Like, their entire... Everything was just fear. <clears throat> No. Then no, you never felt this before. Okay. All of a sudden, it just strikes you. You're not afraid of anything in particular. You're just terrified. Yeah. I've got an anxiety disorder. Uh, yeah, yes. You're having a panic attack, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh boy. All right, Obo. You with me? Follow me. Come on. Slap me in the face. I, I don't want to. Bring me I'll around, do it. me in the I'll, face. I'll do it. I have very thick skin, it won't hurt, I promise. Hey, I'll, I'll, I'll slap over in the face. Does this calm me down? Roll me another <laughs> wisdom saving throw. <laughs> it's anger. Eleven! Eleven, yeah. Uh, oh, that's fine. All, all of a sudden, uh, the fear goes away. Uh, it's just replaced by pure rage uh, at, at Meritrix <laughs> for smacking you in the face. I slap them again. Uh, <laughs> again. Okay, roll me another wisdom saving throw. Fifteen. It's Fifteen. Perfect. Uh, yeah, you. Uh, the second smack it brings you around completely. Uh, isn't that lucky? Guys, we got to do this quick. This uh, we found a foolproof method. Is... But yeah, let's uh, let's let's go. Never mind the blazing inferno. I'm sure it'll put itself out. Let's go. Yep. <laughs> We're not firemen. I'm sure this sprawling city yeah, has firemen. Yeah, we got more important things. We got we to get yeah. to the Oh, I happen to know some fires. sexy firemen in my cult, actually. They'll sort it out. <laughs> <laughs> There's plenty of liquids going around in his cult. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I summoned the sex cult to come on the fire. Uh, they are already feeling absolute pure lust, so nothing really happens to them. They just continue to lust. Yeah. Uh, Southeast. Right. Southeast. So when you get to this crossroad. Gosh, but I go. Bink bonk. You see a man sprinting uh, northwards up the road towards you. Who is sex culting onto the fire? Dear Lord. That is <laughs> horrifying. A little artistic interpretation of events. Why has he got a turnip like? What? His, his his left leg, our right. <laughs> Why's he got one again? one bollock above his penis? And the other yeah, <laughs> I don't know what penis yeah. looks like. <laughs> oh, Ben, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Um. And also, it's as big as your arm, to be fair, or oh. a leg. So, good job, man. But also, Jesus Christ. Um. Uh, yeah, the man <laughs> sprints down the road towards you, uh, screaming about how he's just seen the lime. The, lo- the lime? The Where lime. Sh- it, she, that oh, lime. Uh, just down, you, you can't miss it, there's a big fucking hole in that house. And he points uh, somewhere down the road, not quite sure where. Hmm. Okay, we'll head down, I guess. Help. Uh, this one here. How how are we meant to defeat somebody who just phases through everything? It's questionable, isn't it? Um... It really is. Have I made a broken character that will kill you all? Uh, yes. I to, I, my vote was leave, so, you know. I have yes, some manacles. Maybe we could manacle her. Uh, someone that can just walk through a house. Yeah, no, I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> 
Oh, I've got that portable hole. <sighs> Damn, it's almost like this is basically a problem-solving game nine times out of ten, it feels like. Mm-hmm. Uh, yes. All right, so you approach this house, and there is just a busty woman-shaped hole. Um, you can see she was mid-stride. Um, you know, especially Meritrix. Meritrix can recognize a woman in mid-stride anywhere. Yeah, absolutely. For whatever reason. Um. Um. It appears to just travel straight through the house. Um, okay. you cannot... Um. Sorry, go on. You can also see, um, in one of her hands, there is another hole where a hand would be that is just dragged along the floor behind her shaped. Oh my. Almost as if she can, upon touching someone, give them the same ability as herself as she's dragging them through the wall. Useful. I once hmm. again vote that we leave. It's tempting, isn't it? It's tempting. Yeah. We're not in a position to fight literal gods. They're but I they're think the, we the city, kill the apostles. Um, well, we kill the apostles to stop Boron from coming. Don't you want to fight Boron? I don't think we're ready to fight Boron. I, I, I... I fear a, a ragtag group of five silver level adventurers would not be able to take down the Great that Spirit. Four plus Barry, to be clear. That's just like yeah. this, man. <laughs> they didn't know shit. I, I mean, what what realistically are, are our options? Like, what we we find these apostles, we try and fight them, probably fail miserably, mm. uh, or we I don't know. Could we trap them? Maybe. Well, what have we got at our disposal? Does anyone have anything that they think maybe could? Um, I have a, a, a being that can literally walk through walls. <laughs> I have uh, Pilar's <laughs> fingers, or Pilar, or Pilar. A powerful wizard. I have upon my person. Uh, I'll pull out of my bag a plush rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, does this plush rabbit have any abilities? Or... Do you have any uh, spells? Uh, does you not just see? Wait. Obviously, this is how. Um... Everyone, roll me a history <laughs> check right now. No. <laughs> Why? Just do it. Sixty One, here. Two, three. <laughs> Sounds about right for Barry. Ten. So twenty-one. For Vincent, Tinkle, so though, ben, you rolled the highest. Mm. Uh, I'm going to send you this. Does this mean anything to you? The killer rabbit of Care Bernog. No. <laughs> it means something to me. Yeah, well, and Jim is aware. So it, it's. Uh, yeah, you, has everyone seen Monty Python? Some of it. Uh, has everyone seen The Holy Grail? Nope. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I remember it. The rabbit uh, there is people, I guess. That's the name of the rabbit. Uh, that is the rabbit that Pizza just pulled out. Ben, you're aware yeah. of that. Oh. That's. Huh. It's. Uh... See, it's obviously this rabbit, as everybody knows. So, um, wow, you must be a very powerful wizard to conjure this. I, as you, isn't it obvious? Um, so, uh, uh, I was starting to uh, doubt you after you started throwing, uh, I think, a random assortment of vegetables during the, uh, um, that, during the trials, but this, um, uh, that was probably someone else, um. Uh, <gasps> If if it was me, I would clearly be casting them, as as a wizard would, you know. <laughs> oh, in an enlightening conversation, um, I still think we're fucked, and I still vote it's leave. More than ever now. Jim, roll me a wisdom saving throw. Oh shit. <laughs> Wisdom. Let's 
Lemiao. Okay. Uh, the emotion you're feeling, Jim, is uh, stupidity. <laughs> yeah. That, yeah, that sounds about right. I like it. It's, he's... The emotions are being uh, affected. It's not working particularly well. It's almost as if you're already under the influence of something else that's affecting your mind, and it's just exacerbating that. Uh, mm. So you are now uh, stuck to two syllable words. <laughs> Excel. <laughs> oh. What did you say? Excel. didn't say excellent. <laughs> <laughs> In character, anyway. Uh, Oh, we'll have fun working around that one. Um, right. <laughs> yeah, you all of a sudden you guys notice that uh, Piz starts to dribble, and it's not Piz he's dribbling neither. I slap him. Uh, I shall receive and slap. Yes. Okay, it doesn't work on everybody. Uh, it would work on most, but Piz is uh, he's got multiple things going on right now. Okay. <laughs> Um, His, uh, you know, the consequences are catching up with him, shall we say. Okay, so, so far we've got what is seems to be an incapacitated wizard, a, ki- a rabbit of some kind, and four underleveled characters. Well, not underleveled, silver tier characters, and a turtle. You lot are think we... I can take him? I mean, I, 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 I maybe you could, Barry. <laughs> maybe you could. <laughs> Do you reckon? Am I willing to die just to find out? No. <laughs> well, let's fuck off then. If I can't take him, you lot can't take him. Let's fuck off. I bet Barry. No, but what do you take think? him? Um. Is the brave party going to abandon the city in need? If Obo, if Obo, I'm Obo, shit. I think if Boron is summoned, we may all be fucked. Are we fucked right now if these guys are fucking up the city? I think, well, we can leave the city for zero consequence. Yeah. Well, for Um, now. Short term consequence, anyway. I'd like to take a refugee if we do decide to. Take a hostage. We should just try and evacuate a few people. I guess. Well, well, you take, to, we we can take the sex cult again. What? Yeah, we'll <laughs> convene the entire sex cult. Yeah, yeah, I would like to evacuate the sex cult. Rescue the bread man. <laughs> we'll use we'll use the Kennedy sex tunnels to get out. I, like I know the where they are. Ship. I rescue the sex Barry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you, Piz. No problem. Is there an underground network of sex tunnels? Because that might be quite helpful <laughs> for escape. No, they've begun to dog them, but it's the first day of the course <laughs> operation. So. Uh, I have a good, I have a good authority that are sex tunnels. <laughs> But yeah, please go to the fountain and admire the sex tunnel. It's one foot deep. <laughs> it's been carved out by erect penis. <laughs> oh. um, uh, erect in more ways than one, yeah. Um, good lord. All right, so the party would like to bail on the sea. Um, I well, well, we should vote on it, maybe. Oh, I was, I was asking you because you're the only one who hasn't said bail. Oh, was I? Sorry, I uh, wasn't listening. Um, You've not quite said it in as many words, Ben. I mean, if we can, well, like, yeah. if there's a way of taking them on that isn't combat, like if we can trap them or trick them, then at, at no point has any ideas, then <clears throat> at, at no point has anyone really said you need to kill them or well, even fire them. You just need to see what's going on and potentially stop it. Mm. But they did. The the guy, the woman yesterday, literally did challenge us to a battle. <clears throat> and you, and how is she going to find you? Do we know what they look for? What do you mean, sorry? The bad friends. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, they appear to be looking for people. Well, she oh. appeared to just be looking for something to do. 
Um, you, you may be aware that the apostates are all uh, sick, sick people that enjoy killing. So sometimes they just get bored and go kill things. Uh, I'm not nice. <laughs> I want to go kill some apostates. <laughs> okay, so Bar- Bar- Barry's up for the suicide mission. Who else is up for the suicide mission? I think it could be an idea to maybe come face to face with one of them to try and see if we can get uh, some answers. Um... What are we? Some kind of self death squad? <laughs> 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 But if everyone else would like to leave, um... if we could see what they're doing without them seeing us, then that could work. I mean, like if we if we, if we approach be... stealthily, uh, I do have a spell for that. Maybe no, I don't. That is a uh, chill pollen. No, it's no, it's over. I do have Pass Without Trace. The fart spell. The, sure, the fart spell. Yeah. Ooh. The veil of shadows and silence radiates from you, masking you and your companions from detection. Oh, I don't really know what that means. Can't be tracked except by magical means. Do we think one of the apostates might be able to do magic? Uh, oh, uh. I reckon so. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, we'll leave no other tracks or traces of passage. Okay, Barry. Tracks not Wisdom same. Sure, please. Tracks oh, not same it. as look around. We've been stood around for too yeah, long. So we we still be uh, that is a two yes. from me. A two. Yeah, I have a plus one, and I got one. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Wait, so you got a natural one? A uh, natural one, yes. Oh, oh no. That's different, mate. Alright, uh, all of a sudden, Barry, uh, you are overcome by <clears throat> unbridled happiness. You are <laughs> so happy. You are euphoric, but, like, actually euphoric. Shit. <laughs> I haven't felt like this since the fucking nineties. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he's like listening. Well, fucking hell! <sighs> I, I, I immediately go to Piers and give him a hug. Hi, it's hi, a really Barry. big hug. I fucking love you, mate. I fucking love you. You're oh. really good at throwing anything. Thanks, pal. <laughs> Th- thanks, Barry. Uh, you too. Uh, okay. Let's let's make some moves. Let's let's fuck fuck it. Let's head southeast. I'll uh, I'll hunt Barry for a while. Well, <laughs> for like too long. But I think we're both fine with it. I think yeah. I'm gonna say I don't think too long is an option for either of you right now. Just gonna walk along, still hugging. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. So you uh, have decided to. I think continue to, to to search for them. Seems like it. Uh, this this house next to you has got a you know apostate sized hole striding away. You know, in this direction. In which this. direction? That way. Okay, so we should do the through opposite. this house. Yeah, like literally through the house. You could probably follow the uh, the trail they left. Or counterpoint, you go the opposite way. Oh, yeah. You can uh, grab your hostages and go. So it's follow this trail or leave. Is that the option? The choices were being given. Quite, no, no, no. Quite, I, quite clear. Yeah, I mean, you could do other things as well. It's D&D. You can choose to go fucking do, go do some sicko shit. You do you. But those are the two obvious things I would say. Okay. The trail of breadcrumbs I'm presenting to you. Um, and as I said to Rian, I was prepared for multiple eventualities in that you guys would just be like, okay, fuck this city, or okay, we'll save the city, or various things in between. So, 
Vincenzo, you're a decisive and yeah, uh, I'm, I'm smart trying man. to not make all the decisions, so I can't be bothered. <laughs> yeah. uh, I say we go fight. Uh, okay. Elbow. I'm not going to bother um, asking the other two because they're too out of it. So. <laughs> Barry. <laughs> I <laughs> miss <laughs> my mom. <laughs> I do too. Well, we have... I do too, please. <laughs> you Your three. mom was really nice. <laughs> <laughs> Two out of three completely incapacitated uh, party members, which may not hold up if we're going to battle. Uh, the very fight. They're just stupid and happy. What do you think, Matrix? I I would I want to do the the sex court whistle and get the fuck out of here <clears> with <throat> my sex court before they all die in a blazing inferno. Mm, mm, mm. Would, in fact, would, I think I would get enough of them together. The rest of the adventure. I I, be... I think <laughs> if they they would be very useful and if and what enough, get enough of them together, we could just dig a tunnel out of here. What of our membership status to the Adventurers Guild? I'm sure there's other guilds. I mean, I'm sure they've the... got a database so they can, you know, inform others <clears throat> of our rank. And if not, then we'll just lie. If the city gets flattened, then it's really your word against whose. Exactly. Mm, we could be gold level adventurers. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Well, that paper hasn't been filled out yet, so. <laughs> I would vote that we go and find one of the apostates. Try and kind of get a sense of right, what. Let's do it. Right, through the, I start run through off. The through the <clears throat> the sized hole. Let's go. I run off through the hole. Cool. Uh, it actually leaves you uh, next to a church. I hmm. set fire to the church and keep running. I don't. The church is too. It's like Ben has been overcome with emotion and so in a pure anger. Which uh, which great spirit is the church to? It is to the great spirit Mool, the great spirit of light. Of light. Okay. Uh, a fitting end. Fire, fire is a kind of light. Which one's yeah. great spirit? I forget. Hilm. Uh, uh, life, I believe. Okay. Would I'll, there I'll, be? I'll, I'll stop to scroll bitch on the side of the church and then keep going. Would there be right, like apostates of him in here? You you know that all of the apostates, apart from one, uh, have got a, a great spirit that they're an apostate too. Uh, Mool being one of them. There is an apostate of Mool. Ah, oh, so they might be okay. in the church. <clears throat> Let's go. Let's breach. We're in. Breach, breach bang and clear. Okay, we'll go. Front door. Hello. You going? Hello. Hold me, Barry. Any I'm scared. I fucking love this architecture. So it's like bitch in here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're in there. Uh, wow. All right. Uh, people, you can put your characters at this opening here. I'm here. I'm not here. What right. fucking opening? I'm pinging the bottom of the screen. Yeah, see, that, see that door there, mate? Uh, I wish I could just keep it so I can permanently see your names. That'd be nice. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, but straight in. No, no worries. Oh, look at that sway. Okay, let's talk to Mr. Swag. <clears throat> Hello. Sway. Mr. Swag. Sway. Uh, he's in the confessional booth. Oh, I would like to get in next to him and pretend to be a priest. <laughs> <laughs> he's on the priest side. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm pushing university on him. How long? Yeah, yeah she's going? getting in the same side as him. You don't uh, understand. <laughs> Hello, my child. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. mm, he does not take well to that. Uh, Rian, make me a wisdom saving throw at, dis <laughs> at disadvantage. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, 15 and a 12. Cool. Uh, you feel crippling sadness. Oh, you, okay. you begin to rock back and forth, uh, holding yourself in the confessional booth as you confess your uh, saddest moments to sway. Uh, please. Oh, you would actually like me to do that? Yeah, I'd like you to confess Oboe's mm. saddest moments to sweet. I see, I see, I see, I see. Well, obviously, I, I think the uh, the main thing would be um, my entire family dying. 
uh, in that terrible, uh, terrible, terrible earthquake. The cabbage farm. All gone. All gone. And for what? For naught. Um, <laughs> He's going to go, hey, hey. What else? What else? Um, we hear I, this. Most yeah, of my you friends can... <laughs> are, are horrible racist towards me, in fact. Uh, yeah, you can all hear this. You oboe went in there being all big man thing, <laughs> and then you just hear her break down. Sometimes I feel like all of my friends hate me because I'm an orc, and um, I. Uh... Sorry, I broke character a little bit. Um... <laughs> 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 and one time I even tried to um, murder a friend with my death stick because they were such a horrible, egregious racist. And, um, well, that I don't actually feel too bad about, but. <laughs> All right. Um, Can I walk in and slap them again? <laughs> but before you do so, uh, Sway will whisper, "You should kill them." Uh, and give me another wisdom saving throw, please, Rian. Just Look. a regular one. See how angry you end up feeling. Twenty-one. Cool. You manage to resist the feeling, and you choose <laughs> not to go out and beat my tricks to death. Okay. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna open to the door slaps. where Sway is, and I'd be like, "What are you doing?" Uh. Make me a wisdom saving throw with advantage, please, Ben. With disadvantage. Disadvantage, please. He is focusing entirely on you right now. Uh, hold on. This doesn't look like a priest. <laughs> An eight. Okay, uh, you feel uh, apathetic. Just pure apathy. You couldn't. You couldn't care less what he's doing. You immediately just step back and just ch chill exist yeah, whatever fuck it vibe yeah um and then he's gonna shout boss boss we've got visitors um still slap oboe. you can still slap oboe yeah that's fine i have my death stick and i'm not afraid to use it <laughs> trying to snap you out of your sadness <laughs> oh i'm still sad yeah give me a slap go for it you're not, but you can ask him to slap okay, you anyway. That's fine. Sad, yeah, you, 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 he just... changed you to anger, which you resisted. Nicely yeah, it's done. Just regular yeah. sadness now. <laughs> Alright, then Sway's gonna run off down the hall. Um, oh. You know, he was chilling in the confessional, and now he's he's not. <clears throat> was that guy a priest? Uh, let me expand this image, and you tell me. <laughs> what do you think? Um. <laughs> Oh, I, I thought you'd photoshopped the hair on. No, that is a real <laughs> picture that I found. <laughs> Don't know who that is. Uh, honestly, if he ever sees this YouTube he video, RIP. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> rooster. He's a punk, so mm. maybe not a priest. Punk rocker in the house tonight. If you uh, were to pr proceed into the church, you may see a priest. Okay. Or a priest-esque figure. I certainly see. Uh... <gasps> Hovis! <gasps> Hovis! I'm going in. I'm going in. Hovis? Oh, well. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, oh, oh, shit. Hovis oh, shit. I'm going out. I'm going out. I'm going out. <laughs> <laughs> We're going in. We're going in. <laughs> okay. We're going in. Fuck it. <laughs> you've done it, gentlemen. You've, uh, apart from pizzas at the door, you found the apostate. <laughs> Pitch is uh, drooling by the door, I think. Yeah, um, face against the door, like, uh, not yeah. knowing what's going on. Barry, Barry, could you go and get him? <laughs> I know how happy you are Come to here, see him. Come here, please. Come here. Uh, I missed you. I miss you too, Barry. <laughs> oh, God. Getting <laughs> <laughs> that one, man. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're in the room now. You are. Uh, as you look around, you realise that you may have bitten off slightly more than you can chew. Uh, you hear uh, at the top of the room. Uh, it just goes, oh, you guys! <laughs> I love you guys. What are you doing here? You dirty bastards! Um, and the rest of the room uh, turns around to look at you from whatever they were doing. 
Um, bad friends. Bad friends. Yes. Yes, it is. These are uh, bad friends, the apostates. Uh, ah. There is a lot of blood scattered around the room. And at the very center of the room, you can see a large wooden barrel. Uh, you can't quite see inside of it. It's a bit too tall, even for you, Obo. Oh, Ten foot tall barrel. Um, is is jam? You do see, yeah, panacea, chuck, um, what appears to be a body inside of it. You're not too sure. Um, <clears throat> hi? And Will, you notice a a uh, man, a Mr. Slash, a uh, pause uh, with his dagger just above the Reverend Like Happy's heart. Oh dear. Uh, as he goes, ah, visitors, welcome to my humble abode. And he'll start to walk towards you guys a little bit. Oh dear. Uh, don't mind us. We were just leaving, actually. Who are you? We, we just we well... here to help. Oh, uh, we might have to, leaving. To help, you say? Well, I couldn't let you leave if you're here to help. We've no. we're, we're here to help with the with the garden. With the garden? Yeah, you, know, <clears throat> said you need your grass yes, cut in. We're a merry band of, of gardens. Yes, yeah, we do need outside. more fertilizer, it's true. But we'll go and do that. We'll, we'll go and oh, do that. Oh, you can become. Well, you, let us speak first. Seeing well, as how you are the first good. adventurers. To oh, we're find not my we're gardens. I'd recognize an adventurer when I see them. You're all dressed up in your weird leather garments. Unless you're a sex cult, of course. Uh that too, but also but gardeners first. Gardening's my first passion. Always has been, always will be. Love me a shovel. Well, I'm afraid I can't let you leave, you see. Venture Bro Garden Company. Uh fact uh Venture Garden flower man. I don't think you're helping, Piz. Uh, I agree with everything this uh, is. Jack uh, is going to raise an eyebrow and look at you guys and go, Is that one okay? Uh, he's a bit. He's my uh, best bloody friend. N- no, <laughs> we go lay down in back. Sway, is this is this you? And then uh, Sway will shrug and cancel his effects on Barry and Piz. Oh fucking hell! Oh, that's a bit of a harsh come down. Yeah. Am I? Am I still? <clears throat> no. I, I thought I wasn't affected by Sway. <laughs> uh, you you were. It was exacerbated. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's something that may haunt you down the line. We shall see. Excellent, excellent. Uh, your future is looking two syllable esque, Jim, shall we say? <laughs> uh, let's make it one. I'll raise you one. Uh, sure. Well, that's easy. <laughs> I'll raise you one. It's, it's yeah. more fun. <laughs> me, Jim, me, one. Exactly. Me, no joy, two. Pizzard uh, has one word name. <laughs> yes. It's Blizzard. Spliz. Two name bad. Bad. Alright. Um... <laughs> God, yeah, interpreting that will be a, a joy for everyone involved, I'm sure. <laughs> uh... Yeah, so he cancelled the effects on you two. You, you've sprung back to normal. Uh, now fully aware you were under the influence of something. Uh, it looks like that emo kid in the corner was influencing you. Not too sure. Uh, and the rest of the apostates are now uh, looking at you with curiosity. Grit is uh, grinning away. Seems to remember the last time you guys fought and were involved. For reference, Barry Grit is the one they fought last time. Oh, they had a fate. All right. They had a fate. Uh, Flash being the one that challenged them. I have given them an actual uh, very pog skin now, so... It's a very good. Yes. I'd like to meet Flash. <laughs> well, yes. 
<laughs> She's a big fan of fire, you see. So. <laughs> it's one of the nerds, Joy. <laughs> Panacea. <laughs> That's the healer one. <laughs> Oh dear. That's the impossible state of life. Thing. Sorry? It's a lime like a Junji Ito drawing. A what? A Junji oh, Ito? Junji like Ito. Yeah, know is. This is a, a fan fiction drawing of the character I stole it from. Oh, oh my it, gosh. It does have everything on display, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Uh, sorry, Ben, your YouTube's been demonetized. Not that you got <laughs> much money from it, I'm sure, but. Uh, no money. That's what's uh, keeping yes. him bread, mate. Uh, speaking of bread, you hear Chad Hobbs going, Oh, big lady! Help me, please! <laughs> Dad, big lady! Dad. Please! They're gonna kill me! No. They keep putting people in that big fucking barrel! Oh my god, I don't wanna die! Huh. It's okay, I'm here to potentially rescue you unless that really fucks me up. Uh, Jack Flash does raise an eyebrow and go, Yes, I, I think it would be a bad idea for you to try and rescue him. Maybe we could come to an agreement. Oh? Oh, I would like to hear. These people? What? What's the barrel made of? Wood. Okay, what's the barrel made of? I'm just curious. I'm just asking to you. <laughs> thick wood. How thick? And mahogany. Mm. Uh, ooh, let's say three inch thick. If it's you big. spare Chad Hovis' life, he could make you uh, one made of bread, and uh, it could be a soup, a soup bowl. Oh, that would be delightful, yes! He's a very talented baker. Uh, I wish I had any of his bread to show you, but um, it's gone, somehow. It was uh, bloody delicious, I tell you. Best bread I ever had. Oh, well, relevant. <clears throat> I'm just so you have a bread bowl for your weird blood soup. Well, the blood soup is... Effectively serving its purpose in its wooden barrel. Mm. I don't believe I need a bread barrel for it. I mean, a bread barrel's an upgrade. Like, you can always upgrade. Yeah. Uh, he's going to raise his eyebrow at that. And he's just going to... Shh! To you, Meritrix. <laughs> um... <laughs> Yes. Okay. What? What? What do they want from us? What, what? What? You know. Why? Why does Jack Slash want to speak to some adventurers? He's not. He's interested in what you have to offer him. You've uh, barged into his uh, oh, abode. Oh, well, him. Okay. Um. What do we have? What do we have? Um. I <clears throat> have. I've got about 50 feet of rope. Would you... Is that enough to... I, I can bring out... I can pull out a plush dog from my bag. What about the, the rabbit? What's the barrel sound? What about the rabbit? Apparently, the rug. apparently this randomizer really likes plush things. <laughs> uh, who wouldn't for uh, whacking people with things you've drawn out of a hat effectively? Yeah, right. No, uh, I'm just gonna say, mm, come on, guys! I don't think you're taking this seriously. Don't give a shit. And then uh, he's gonna walk over. <laughs> you're no longer apathetic either, Ben. To be clear. Very good. Um, he's gonna walk over. He's gonna casually stab Reverend Like Happy straight in the heart. Mm. Jesus. <clears throat> and he's going to drag his body. Uh, in absolute <clears throat> silence the entire time. And just chuck his body straight into the soup. I have a handful of blue shit that I got from those moths, and I'm going to <gasps> mage hand a handful of blue shit into the soup. Uh, unfortunately, Ooh. the Hierophant uh, steps forward, and uh, your blue shit just falls to the floor as your spell fails. What the fuck? Um, hey, what the f what's your game? Uh, less of that, please. What's your game? Couldn't. Magic is a... Fool's game, you see. Do, do you have another one, Vinny? Uh, no. Ah, uh, I was just gonna throw it. Yeah, fair. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've got a couple of pounds on me. 
Are any uh, of these people followers of Borat? He's going to kill Chad. He's going to kill Chad Hovis. No! No! I just thought I'd no, get no, your no, attention. No, 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 no. no. Uh, you can't kill, kill him. Don't kill that guy. He's don't, cool. don't kill our uh, father, please. Now I have your attention, I see. Uh, he okay. Makes, he makes good He's going to click his fingers and point at the lamb and point at Chad, and she's going to go hover next to him. Um... He's now aware that you've got at least a slight attachment to someone, something in the room. So now we can take this a little bit more seriously, I suppose. What exactly do you hope to do here? Uh, we want to Leave? stop you from summoning Borand. Ah, uh, it's too late for that, I'm afraid. What are you doing here, He's already summoned. Well, we're just hurrying the process along, you know. Huh. The more time they have to evacuate, the less people that will die. Yeah, we wouldn't guess. like that, would we? But uh, truth be told, since I'm doing a villainous monologue, it is uh, it's already too late. He's thoroughly on his way, and this barrel will only draw him faster and faster. Uh, side of barrel. Uh, can I? Can I cast a spell? Now, unfortunately, the Hierophant is uh, influencing you right now, and spells would uh, fizzle out and fail almost immediately. Fucking bitch ass bastard. Yep. Um. Grit, grit. Listen, listen, man. You know you loved us. You loved especially Vinny over here. Um, oh, listen, you dog we him, can, yes. But we can help you. We can um, attend to some of your needs if you if you help us out with uh, some of your friends here, because uh, we're friends with you, obviously, and you want us to you know be big strong lads. Um, especially me, because I wasn't. I, I didn't share it to you, you know. Um, but. Uh, okay. We have yeah. a friend who's shitting himself in the back, um, and uh, yeah. he was really cool too. You liked him? No, not Barry. The other one. Barry's new. Well, Barry's not new because you, um, because he was shitting him. They they gave each other, uh, this disease. It it like makes you makes you really like flaky. Um, it it's weird. <laughs> it's, it's really weird. <laughs> um, but l l listen, listen, okay? We um, we've got Barry here. We can we can test we can test out some stuff with you and Barry, and you know we're <laughs> trying to get stronger because you want us to try and get stronger. But okay, we, okay, we need, tell you we what, Chad, we need tell animals. you what, and he, he's gonna you know raise his hand to shut you the fuck up. Okay, okay, <laughs> yes, he's gonna. Sorry. Gentler, gentler. Oh. No. If this Barry fella can do this to me, then he's going to put his hand on the lime's back and uh, just like push his hand into her back. Uh, and as his <clears throat> hand and wrist touches the back, it just disappears and he continues to push until there is literally only a Stump of his arm remaining. Um, I'm I'm really sorry, point. Grit. Can you? I didn't see that actually. Uh, can uh, you? Can you do it again? He's gonna walk up and he's gonna go. Yes. If you can do that to me, you fucking cheeky shit. So, so, sorry, yes, Dad. Then I will consider <laughs> what you're saying. For until you can match what these boys are offering, I don't think I listen to you. Uh, so he's going to give you one attack, Barry. He's going to give me one attack. One attack. <laughs> uh, you need to do as much damage as you possibly can. He's going to walk up and he's going to do like the uh, fucking Christo... What is it? Oh. Christ Redeemer? Christ? What is the Brazilian yeah, yeah, yeah. Christ Christ Redeemer. Redeemer. Yeah, Christ the Redeemer. I think it's like Christo the Renator in Brazilian. But I... yeah. Oh, Christo yeah. Redentor. He's yeah, that's the one. Is what you're he's going to come up and he's going to t pose and just like <laughs> thrust. I'm the sorry, I only speak uh, gamer. Uh, if you see <laughs> this enlarged thing, Ron, he's going to thrust his giant metal cod piece straight at you. Uh, right. This, and, uh, this fully enrages me. I'm a proud man. Uh, yep. I, I enter I a enter rage. You can prepare as much as you like to try and do as much damage as possible in one attack to him. Uh, you okay. know, plan this out. <laughs> 
Oh, Christo Redento is the special op, the spec ops level I always play on Modern Warfare 2 when I'm testing an Xbox 360. Oh, is it? Yeah, <laughs> there you that's, go. The na- that's the name of it. Is it the, oh, the favela one? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So, I wonder why it was so, like, I remembered it so easily. There you go. <laughs> Modern Warfare 2. I, I wish I could do something to buff Barry, but I don't have anything. Yeah, I was thinking mm. that too. I've got Heinz yeah. beans. Grit, grit will say, Hierophant. Let them do what they want. And she will yeah. raise an eyebrow and remove what appears to be blocking magic. Uh, At I'll, least for I'll, you two. I cast Shatter on the barrel. Oh, shit! <laughs> All right. Uh, this fucking guy. Let me do this. That's the great. barrel... <laughs> Shatters. It's done now. It's fine. The <laughs> it's ten damage. Barrel shatters. It's, it's just inanimate object. I think you shattered it. It's fucking wood. You know. Cool. It's fine. Uh, let me move that, them out of the way. Uh, they will dodge out the way of this uh, leaking of blood. Uh, and Jack Flash will clap his hands and go, "Oh, bravo, bravo! That, my friend, was a terrible mistake." Oof. Um, and the apostates will pause as they realize that you've immediately betrayed them, which, you know, the villains, betray them all you like. Uh, he, he will raise a hand as Grit pulls back his fist to begin a swing. And they go, Grit, Grit, wait a second. This affects nothing. It merely... Enforces that Borund will attack right here, right now. What? I was oh, going to God. offer them the chance of moving the barrel away. Oh, fucking hell. But uh, oh, unfortunately, guys. they've been set up, you see. No, no, you, you did your best. You did your best. Lime, kill Chad Hovis for that, please. And the Lime immediately beheads Chad Hovis as well. No! <laughs> Right, okay. It's, it's back off. It's back off. We should we should, we should run now. <laughs> and he's gonna click his fingers and go, "No, Meritrix, oh. don't do that." Oh, okay. Now you fucked up. That is for sure. However, it is not a problem for me or anyone here. Apart from maybe Grit. You see, Grit wanted to make sure he was eaten by Borund to challenge his uh, sensibilities, you see. We we're going to keep him company. We we could eat him, but like, it might take a while. <laughs> I'm pretty hungry still. Grit's going to laugh at that and go... I don't fucking think so. You guys are some dirty puffers. You couldn't do shit to me. <laughs> oh my gosh. You can fuck off, mate. I'll fucking have you. Go on in, lad. Think you're old enough? Take a swing. Yeah. I take a swing. Take a swing. Roll some damage. Uh, to hit sixteen. Hit. Oh, I, I, um, I, um, I guess I hit, and then I do have uh, a three spell. damage. <laughs> Three damage, right? Um, He's gonna laugh. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Quick, Go so on, Ren. Then fucking hit me back, then. I don't think I will. You're pathetic. Go on, Ren. Oh, I was gonna say I have a spell to enable Barry to hit harder, but well, yeah, no. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, I was gonna trying. use it when it was going to punch him in the back real hard. Uh, yeah. Oof. Oof. R.I.P. Chad Obis. All right. Um, Fuck him. <laughs> Grit's going to continue to laugh at Barry and put his hand on his shoulder. <clears throat> uh, Barry, give me a strength oh. saving throw. Strength saving throw. Uh, uh, nine. He's going to just with push a, you over. Will advantage because he's <laughs> raging? Uh, no, he's no longer raging. Does he not? No, so he's taking control of his emotions. Um, Sway so recognizes that Barry's getting angry and just immediately calms him down. Uh, so yeah, uh, but Grit's gonna 
Just well, push you down to the floor and just hold his hand on your shell and continue to laugh. Fucking hell. Fuck off. <laughs> Fucking pathetic. What we doing then, boss? He's going to refer back to Jack Slash. He's going to say, well, seeing as how these guys have attempted to ruin our plans, it is only right that they stay here with you, Grit. I would say, and see if they can also survive. Great Boron, as it were. Many objections? I retreat to shell. That's fine, you're still being held down by Grit. Yeah, I'm just in my shell. Sorry? I do a persuasion. You can try. He asks for any objections. Why? Jack Slash. Yes. Are you in charge? I see many powerful people in this room. Uh, I do not quite know what your powers are, but I feel that individually, all these people would probably be more powerful than you. Um, because I enable them, darling. Hmm. You think these people could uh, come up with a plan quite so brilliant and dashing and charming? Is mine? Maybe not. But I feel like Grit would be able to um, crush your skull in the palm of his hand. Yes, and the lime could kill him right now, should I wish. Mm. And mm. the lime and I have an agreement of sorts. I see. What's the agreement? Ah, well, that would be telling, wouldn't it? Yes, that's what we want you to do. <clears throat> I don't think I shall. Oh, shit. Shit. She didn't piss, in fact. Yeah. So, I yes, I think... Like everyone you... in this room could unionise and maybe start a more powerful alliance. Um, Why would uh, us noble folk unionize? Well, I mean, there's just like some kind of injustices in the world, you know? You, yeah. You've got to like know what you want, and sometimes somebody above you isn't willing to give injustice. that to you. So you have to... <laughs> we yeah. are injustice, my boy. Ah. We are bigger That's... and stronger than most. That sounds like a kind of toxic way of thinking you know like if you think that you're just bigger than everyone else and you can push them around then like not bigger i am merely better i mean again that, that's kind of a, a bad a cool way of thinking. That's, that's like the way that you get people rising up against you you get like you know like you'll get people you know assholes like us who just are living their lives, and then you kill someone because you think they're better, and then suddenly these people rise up and they're like, oh, look, I'm even cooler than you are. Oh, I am terribly afraid. Yeah, as you should be. That's that's what I'm... I mean, good, I guess. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, it, it's it's tricky, because you, you, you're kind of creating your own enemy, you know, that whole thing of like, oh, you killed my father and my daughter, and prepare to die and you're just like creating your own demise you know it's kind of going against itself when if you give people the respect that like no 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 i am gonna kill you i'm not gonna leave you alive i'm gonna kill everyone here then you'll have uh Oh. No, uh, uh, I my head on my shell and I'm like, quiet, bit. mate. Bit yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. I've got ahead of myself. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you can't enlighten the fucking enemy. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> so you're saying I should kill. No, more? no, 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 Maybe. I, I don't know. Let me think about it. Let me come back to you. <laughs> Okay, any other objections? If you uh, let us will... go now, I'll give you the other Hovis brother. Oh. <laughs> Bread. It's a pass. There's more than one. They're common, common people, the Hovises. I'll find them all. I'll kill them. 
I'll kill you, every Hovis brother. You traitor. You're threatening to kill the great worm Borand? Sorry? Borand Hovis? Oh, Borand yeah. Oh, shit! <laughs> Fuck! Oh. <laughs> That's canon now, I'm afraid, darling. Borand <laughs> 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 I'm not sure Borand's going to be very happy that you killed his brother then, in fact. Ah, uh, Borand revels in death, you see. He's a, a like-minded spirit. Oh. As I'm sure the lime would agree. The lime nods. As the lime is the apostate of death. Mm. You... How can you death people if they're in life? He's going to look around and... Was that to me? Yeah, it was. How can you death, How can you make dead people if you haven't got alive people? Grit, can you squish him for me, please? <laughs> and Grit's going to put a bit more weight on your shell, Barry. Ah, fucking hell! You, you're going to give me a crack, mate! Fuck off! Come on! <laughs> I was about to ask the lime if she has met Borand. Um... She'll look at you and shrug. That's not an answer. Her bahongas jiggle. <laughs> That's more of an answer, I guess. <laughs> That's Do they jiggle in language. like an up and down motion, like a nod, or like a side to side motion, like a head shake? Uh, I'm not an expert on what tits do when you shrug your shoulders. Right. Uh, You're lost, bro. <laughs> yeah, rip me, I guess. Uh, they are in a shrugging motion, Rian. Take from that what you will. They're probably doing a shrugging motion with the tits as well. They like go up and then like the the arms of the tits go outwards and like a, I don't fucking right. know. I see. Okay. I'd like to tell that I've met Borand. Um, the line will raise an eyebrow. I've met him. I have, in fact, tussled with the. Uh, the great spirit Borand. Uh, Lime will like... walk all the way up to you and look you straight in the eye as you're the exact same height. Yeah, wonderful. I would like to proffer uh, Borand's tooth uh, and say, do you know how powerful someone must be to steal a tooth from the mouth of Borand? All right, she will... <laughs> tooth. <laughs> Uh, and all of a sudden, uh, the tooth dissolves where she grabs it. Shit. <laughs> that, that is now a half tooth of Borand, Rian. Please note that down. The spiky end. No, you have the blunt end. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm going to assume you proffered it to a spiky end towards her. Uh, sure. uh, and then she will merely raise an eyebrow and then gently pat you on the cheek in a very patronizing manner and smile. Pretty hot. Okay. Um... Sorry, mommy. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> sorry, mommy. Sorry. sorry. <laughs> I, I put uh, Boren's half tooth back. Yeah, and head. then she will turn and walk away mm. to look at the puddle of blood that is forming. Well. Uh, excellent arguments all round, I would say, for me not leaving you here with grit to be eaten. Uh, but I'm afraid it is... Uh, he looks down at his, his wrist, even though there's no watch on it. Yeah, about time for me to leave, I'm afraid. Uh, and the apostates will form up and move out. And you're going to say, but I think I will leave the lime with you, just to make sure that you boys don't go astray. Please say they like transform into a like a megazord and then. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they definitely don't just get deleted as they walk away. And then they blast off. Yeah. Yep. Uh, and Grit will go. All right, boys. Best take a seat then. And he points at the empty pew uh, here. Mm. I'll sit down. I don't know if I want to sit in that pew. Can I sit in this pew? I'm going to take a load off. You can sit wherever you want. It's only two ways out of the building. Uh, the lion will go casually rest on this door, and Grit will stay where he is. 
Can I run? Is that an option now? Is running an option? You could try. Okay. Can I try running out of the, the door we came in, in, bro? I go I go and sit near him. I quite um although I felt very emasculated by the interaction, I kind of have a respect for him now. <laughs> How high's the ceiling? Fifty foot. Okay. It's church is very tall. How high can an orc jump? Less than <laughs> Less than that. <laughs> like How three, high three <laughs> foot max? Number. Yeah, like three foot, maybe? Let's say three is it foot. Not, is it not like a good day? Your... It's, it's based on strength. Oh, when, whatever the fuck DD says, yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> My strength is 11. Shit. Right. Well, carry on between yourselves. Thanks for the 11. 11 you foot. It's yeah, 11 three foot plus sure. your strength modifier. So about five foot, then I think. So three. No, four foot. Well, my friends, no, it's three. No, it's eleven plus one. Oh, fuck me, well. Yeah. <laughs> just okay. three foot then. I just think because I have the spell jump, um, so I can now jump nine foot. So let's bear that in mind, boys. Uh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's the other forty-one distance. feet. Hey, I mean, if you look at the floor, there is a stained glass window. Yeah, uh, above, well, that's precisely what. Actually, I was no, thinking. above here. Oh. But it's about twenty foot up, so. Okay. Oh, Ooh. sorry. That's if you if you run if you run ten feet before the jump, and you make a standing okay. jump, you can only jump half the distance. <laughs> so <laughs> you could jump one point five feet. Jump. That's fine. Um, maybe if we all stood on each other's shoulders, then I'd be able to jump out of the building. Right, great. It's stood there. You, I guess. Yeah, but some of the whoever's at the bottom would still have to run. That's that's doable. And who are you okay. leaving to their face? Uh, I'll say oh, oh, well, actually, I guess, by the way, Finney is here the entire time for reference. Oh, yeah, <laughs> because, <fine>. yeah. <laughs> Is Finney in the pot? Uh, uh, Finney, yeah, he's passed out in the blood, in the pool of blood. <clears throat> I got 54 rope. Got 54 rope. I got 50 foot of rope and a hammer, so maybe foot we of could rope. make some kind of like sly raccoon. You know what he does with his, what's that called? You want to make a sly raccoon? <laughs> like a grapple? I'm not, I'm not sure like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, grapple. Sly raccoon. Can I just make a break for the door? There's no one covering the door. <laughs> well, where, how are you going to make a break for the door? Just run to this door. <laughs> Ping the door. This door. Okay. Please, try and run past Grit. Oh, I thought <laughs> Grit was busy. Grit is not busy. Grit is just sat there with his arms folded looking at you guys. Oh, can I jump over him? Yes. How high can you jump? <laughs> <laughs> I have established how tall Grit is, so please. How is high... <laughs> yeah, I've already said this. Tell me how, you can, how high you can jump, and I'll remind you after you try. Um, I can jump four feet. Four feet. <clears throat> wow. Uh, Grit is ten feet tall. Right. Um, I'm about seven foot. Can I... I put it on my shoulders. Can I slide through his legs? Hmm. You can certainly Mike, try. Is um, cod piece. No, no. Will you no. <laughs> sprint at Grit and attempt to slide between his legs? I don't know. I don't see a way out. Please give me a dexterity check. Uh, no, what, what, athletics or acrobatics? Uh, acrobatics. That's probably good. acrobatics. No, that's good. athletic. It's more athletic. Acrobatics. Uh, I think uh, it's stealth because I'm trying to do it without him noticing. Athletic you... strength stuff. I think acrobatics. I think it is, yeah, trying to him the, the worst throw. Acrobatics. Athletics, go. I think acrobatics. Athletics, go. I, I would prefer to roll acrobatics. The though. DM does not care. I'll do a I'll do a somersault and backflip on the way. Oh, I have decreed. <laughs> come on, come on, Thomas. <laughs> come on. I am power tripping, sir. Uh, you said yeah. dexterity, though, and acrobatics is dead. Yeah, and if you just gone for it, and I thought about it, and I was like, wait, hang on a minute, it's not just a strength thing. They have things for this. It's not a dexterity, um, how athletic you are. Just fucking go for I it. Can I try to distract Grit in order to help out Meritrix? Uh, no. Okay, cool. Yep, yep, fuck <laughs> off. Oh. No. <laughs> yep. Go, Meritrix, send it. Have I got a de have I, have I got death proofness here? Or is, it, is death an option? Of course it is. <laughs> Why don't you what? figure it out? That is always an option. <laughs> six. That is a natural. No, it's not a natural one. It's just a six, isn't it's it? Oh, okay. natural one. I, I always see that one. And I think holy virtual natural one. Okay. Uh, as you attempt to go between his legs, 
He just yeah. sits on you. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's fine. Just is it though? Probably so, not. You gonna roll me? Uh, let's see. I'm, I'm just gonna give him a straight hit. You're gonna take. So you just sat on your fucking head. <clears throat> Fourteen damage, Will. It's all good. This fucking ten it's by only, ten orc. It's only half of my HP. Well, it's all good. <laughs> Has just sat on you and goes, "Oh, you cheeky bitch, get back in there!" And he's gonna pull you out and chuck you back into the middle of the room. It's, it's worth a go, right? Any other suggestions? <laughs> uh... See what he has to say. What the, you want to know what the the demon of death worm thing has to say? It's just going to eat us. I mean, it might not. Can I can I see if Hovis is going to be okay? Yes, you approach Hovis's body. Uh, I can get it back on the thing. That's Hovis. Uh, unfortunately, um, let me <clears> give him a name, and you'll. Maybe realize why he's not okay. He's got a name now. Um, oh no! <laughs> yes. Find uh, his head. Put it back on. Uh, well, unfortunately, <clears throat> you can't find his head. However, the entirety of his neck is just gone from existence as the lime mm-hmm. put uh, her hand through his head. Um. Okay. Everyone, come come over here. Come over here. Oh, I've got you... I've got I've got something to show grit that I think he'll like. <laughs> Now, Barry, I must warn you, I don't bend that way. No, 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 no. I've got both, you see, I'm a total. But anyway. <laughs> You've got a cloaca, just like me. <laughs> I have got a cloaca, right. But I've, got, I've got other things I can use as a bit of a, a willy. Um, uh, I'll, I'll show you what I, I want to show you. So I kind of bring, it, bring him over to the side, over to the corner here. I ain't moving. All right. And then I... I I reach into my shell and I pick out Miss Bintruck's nudes. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna go, oh, fuck, snap! He's gonna pull out his his copy as well. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy! What the fuck? <laughs> hey, look at the fucking knockers on her. She's oh, lovely. I've had many a good night thinking about her. I <laughs> me too. When I was shitting myself, all I could do was look, look at her while I was shatting. <laughs> Fucking that, that was like a... trading cards. <laughs> <laughs> yes, everyone has a copy. Oh, it's, a uh... it's truly impressive. Oh, go on, then, lad, and he shows you uh, Miss Bintruck's nudes. Four. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a fucking piece of her. What a fucking slapper. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh... Guys, this is a fucking distraction. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you fucking doing? It's a distraction and it's fucking working and you're looking at the distraction. Fuck off. I get my gorilla goo and I yep. splash it all over Grit's feet. And then I go, what the fuck is that? And then I. You just came on my feet? Yeah. I know, I know it's good news, mate, but calm down. Uh, and then he's going to attempt to pull his feet off the floor. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I noticed that you stood back immediately. <laughs> uh, yeah, he, he's just going to pull his feet off the floor, but like he's left like <clears throat> the majority of his skin on the floor. Oh, shit. Mm. Oh, that's right. spicy, mate. Uh, you should have given me a little bit of warning before you gave me such pleasure, but uh, yeah, I appreciate it. And he's going to hold out his face for a respect bump from uh, you, Vincenzo. I'll be like, All right, fair enough. I respect that. I'll, I'll bump yes, him. thank you, brother. Yeah. Does he take up any of the floor with him? Uh, I suppose, I imagine... The floor actually probably was weaker than his skin, so let me wreck on that to him just pulling up the floor. Okay. He now so has cavity, shoes. Cavity Thanks, under the hole. Yeah, no. What? Worries. What? I didn't hear what you said, sorry. Is there like a hole under the hole? Is there yeah, hole? he just pulled up like part of a floorboard. Can we get into the hole? Does the hole lead anyway? But do you have a portable hole? 
it's a foot oh, sized it's a foot sized hole. It's probably like a, a foot by a foot because he's got chunky feet. A question. Ask it then. Just can we okay. It, you could, you'd just die. We've done it. Why? It, we've Cause... done it in this campaign. <laughs> <laughs> can we get into the bag? What bag? The bag of holding. You could. There's no air in the bag. It has like a foot wide entrance, just so you know. I'm very, I'm very thin. There's that as well. Actual correct very response. Very tall, but very thin. Obo is not a foot wide. <laughs> it's a foot wide. It's my character, bitch. Obo is a foot wide and eight feet tall. Okay. <laughs> Barry, I'll say Barry. <laughs> I'm going to crawl into Jim's bag of holding like a snake. <laughs> <laughs> For what purpose? Because <laughs> I've just noticed a feature out of my portable hole that would fully get us out of this situation. Like, what is you getting in the bag? Holding. What is the feature of a portable hole that's got to do with a bag of holding? If you put a hole. portable hole down while you're in a bag of holding, it creates a gate to the astral plane. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> You know, I have got two weeks coming up on work, so I've got two weeks to prepare the astral plane. You're not wrong. Uh, any creature within <laughs> ten foot is sucked through and deposited in a random location. On the I, I so dive is... headfirst into that bag. Blit yeah. the pie. <laughs> yeah, I've got a bag of holding as well. I'll, I'll get in. We'll get bag. in these bags. Is this doable? Okay, we, we all need to be in one bag. <laughs> right, in one bag. I'd no, love to it. say yes. We're not all fit in one bag. Well, you're not. It's a foot wide. We're all a foot not... wide, Tom. Yeah, We're I'm all a foot fucking wide. elf. I cast enlarge. On, I cast enlarge on the bag of holding. Oh, the, the opening I can only becomes. Apologize, Tom. The opening <laughs> becomes three <laughs> feet wide. <laughs> Oh, if God. I'm saying, hang on. If it sucks all creatures in within ten feet, that includes like grit. Grit, yes. Or but it's yeah. no, no. the line. Right. You know what it does? It, you know what it does specify though? <laughs> a random location in an entire fucking plane. I'll take my chances. Jim, I mean... can you just explain the astral plane to me just for a second? Oh, okay. So imagine it's essentially the um, upside down from. Um, a Stranger Things, where right. you have no idea. It's like Whether exactly the same there. as the regular world, but it's just blank. It's just like empty, it's just forever. There's not like ghosts. It's just like a weird purgatory that you jump into, and then you traditionally, like it's if you have a blink effect, so then you go jump, you hop mm. into a dimension where the wall isn't there, and then you move past the wall. Okay, but. So this is a, this is a bag of holding and a bag of holding trick. Then <laughs> everyone that, dies. Yeah, Why? then that's like okay. You're putting a portal into a portal, and you're like essentially pulling the fabric of space and time inside out. Okay. And you're full but pulling. Would we the, die. Yeah, probably. I think we take like roll me damage. an arcana check, Vincenzo, Tingle Toes, and Piz, the two wizards of the group, to. To judge this idea for what it is. Piz, you are so on board, it's not even funny. Like, you don't even know. You're uh, appropriately so. Oh, you think it's going to work just fine. Vincenzo, you recognize it for the instantaneous death that it is. Uh, I think that's a bad idea, boys. Hang on, <laughs> right, hang on, open. No, 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 you've, no, got no, a, no. you've got a hole. You've got a hole. You've got a hole, right? Right. So can you not just put the hole down? We can go through the hole. Right, I'm gonna go for a piss while this goes on. I'm listening but can not you, talking. You can merely sit in the hole. I've checked the hole. I've had a. It's... Okay, but it's a hole. You can yeah. put it on a wall. Oh. Can you can make right. a hole in the wall. Oh, piss blizzard. Yeah. We put you it on the uh, trust to one hole on a check guy. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah right. Right. you, you, you can put it on the wall. <laughs> I'll say. <laughs> okay, Are you going to trust a 15 Arcana check type of guy? Let's fucking pull the hole out of this bitch, boys. Which wall? The wall's all the way up. Oh, there's a wall right here. I would like to put it on this wall. 
That, why that one? That's not a wall. That's an invisible wall. <laughs> <laughs> that is possibly the least helpful wall you could possibly find out. You can see us in this room, it's all good. This is the to the danger. <laughs> this giant worm of death is a, <laughs> we are immune to him in this one room. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You said the windows were too high up. No, no, no. The stained table. glass window is too high up. Other windows <laughs> are at a functional level. So we could just jump through a window. <laughs> oh, idea. Please ping the windows when you see them. Oh, There's lime's at the, the bottom. Left. Is lime at this window? Is that the problem? That's a door, so we can't go through that. <laughs> lime's there. there. A door, a window, and a window. That's there. the only window that. Where's the other window? I see one window. One here. No, one, here. And one down here next to the confessional. Right, so we're nowhere near any of them. <clears throat> but there's, there's a, a door, door here. here. I oh. say we run. I say we run. I'm running. Can we run? Is that a thing we can do? Can we just yeah. make a break no, for no, it? Maybe we can Either try. Oh, where are these guys going? I'm leaping. I'm leaping. I'm leaping. Alright. Oh, Oboe, you're the first through the window. Let's get an athletics check to smash through this window and dolphin dive into that pond outside of it. Big chilling, big chilling, big chilling. What's over here? 20! Natural 20, baby! Wow. Alright, uh, Oboe smashes through the window, uh, athletically doing a, a front flip? But no, yeah, you describe it. You got the fucking roll. Okay, so it's kind of like... I, I leap in such an epic way, directly, vertically forward. That made a lot of sense. Uh, <laughs> 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 it's like like T posing. Forwards and I am forwards T posing the whole way. And in fact, as I'm T posing, smashing through this window, you can even swear I go up a little bit higher, like I'm gliding through the air. Like I'm fucking flying in my teepers. I do a front flip, I do a back flip, I do another front flip. It's crazy. And then I crash into the water. Right. Uh, and at this exact moment, uh, coincidentally, you rolled a two last session, Rian. Uh, uh -huh. two, two hours into this session, uh, Borand appears. Oh, Shit. fuck. And a, uh, you know, Absolutely fucking <laughs> annihilates where you are stood. Um, Rian does this incredible, majestic flip, and you all uh, just pause for a second, and then the floor just erupts beneath you. Is this like a whale? Are we in like, Boron? Uh, just beneath Obo, before uh, underneath all of us. Boron's moor is a uh, hundred feet wide. I don't, so. Have you seen the hole? I was <laughs> looking at the map. Right. Okay. I've just, oh, I was I've just got on the map and gone. Ah. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we weren't actually there. We were. Yeah, we were over here. Yeah, but God, you are. <laughs> you, one of you had the uh, fucking Laosian on your shoulders as well as this happened. Yeah. Um. We've fallen and... into a pit. To its moor. If you would call Borund a pit, sure. Uh, Borund has just... Oh, we've been eaten. Yeah, Borund has just, you know, almost in the exact spot where that fucking cauldron was, uh, annihilated himself upwards. Do we he see his just... uvula? Uh, yeah. Oh no, you don't want to grab his uvula while... It's covered in sand. Is it is sandy. You're right, Obo. It's covered in sand. Uh, it's, you know, enormous as well. It's like 30 foot... Mm. 34 oh. uvula, impressive. We don't even have uvulas, but he's got one. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> he's a spirit of death. Come on, he can have a uvula. Yeah, he's got his, got his own fucking shit. And you guys, uh, as you are entering the moor, you actually. Wait, 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 you... wait, wait, guys, guys. 
got got something that we need to listen to while while this is happening. Oh God! <laughs> oh, God. I knew it was going to be this. It's a fucking sandworm! Oh my God! Uh, yeah, so you actually, you know, Rem's feet uh, never actually hit the water. Her momentum just seems to just continue upwards for her as. Everything beneath you is just blasted upwards. <laughs> like a Scooby Doo um, scene where it just stops me there, doesn't notice the ground's gone. So and you just <laughs> and then looks down. Straight up it goes. Um, scratch. Yep, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> totally ten out of ten on the coolest dive ever done, but uh, you know, I'm here now. Uh, and yeah, you are engulfed by darkness and you just see a faint light at the top and then you hear an ear shattering roar uh, and I do mean ear shattering I need you all to roll me a constitution check please uh, apologies uh, uh, what's that 40 6 um, 9 9 alright anyone on the roll below a 10 you yeah, roll two yeah. oh, no. cool. You take this much damage. Oh, uh, I'm back dead. in the Discord. <laughs> level of damage. So, who is first in the Discord? This failed their constitution saving throw. That uh, was like below ten. Chill. Did you fail? No, I passed. They all failed at me. I failed. Yep. Ben, you take fourteen damage. Yep. And then. Next one takes 12 damage. Pardon? 12? 12. I'm still alive! <laughs> <laughs> Jim, did you fail yours or not? Uh, I read the most recent one. Which oh, is, yeah. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Cool, that's fine. And that's just from the, the roar that he makes he, you know, breaches <clears throat> the earth. Um, yeah, not ideal, shall we say. And then you... Begin to feel gravity reassert itself upon you, and you begin to tumble into the depths of Borund. Uh, I yell at Obo. Uh, I go, remember that trick with the bag in the hole? <laughs> <laughs> While tumbling. <laughs> Honestly, I uh, take a random... Oh, actually, I'm dead either way at this point, so... <laughs> so That'd it's more be... of a question of whether you'd rather all be together inside of Borund, and... Would I do a TPK with this little control from you guys or not? Is the other question. I mean, I'm assuming you're not just going to kill us all off if, while now we're in our room. Apart from Finny, maybe. Um, <laughs> no, no. You uh, you begin to fall into the worm. Uh, you can you feel that the hot stench of death as you fall deeper and deeper into the worm. Um, but there is a there's a steady stream of light. Like he's gone straight up into the air, and his moor is wide open. So there is a a beam of light following you down, at least for now. Um, and as you travel downwards, it it seems like it could be tens of seconds potentially. You're not actually too sure how long it's been. Unless anyone here is an expert on falling to their death. Uh, speak now if you are. No? Yep. You're an expert on falling yeah, to your death, Ren. Ren, it's exactly 7.3 seconds. It's 7.3 seconds of falling precisely. Okay. Um, which, long, you know, if you figure that out with the <clears throat> maximum velocity of an orc, will tell you the exact difference, uh, dest- uh, diff- difference? Uh, dimensions of Borund from mouth to stomach. You right, know, I see. You figure that out should you yeah. wish. Yeah, I'll, I'll work that out, mate. Yeah, but, you know, you yourself as as a man that knows that shit. Um, as you feel the putrid air rush past you, you see the pinkish stew of his stomach steadily okay. approach you. I don't want to fall in. Um, and... sorry, go on. No, no, and a panic begins to grip you as you. Okay. <laughs> Desperately try and think of a way out of this situation. You seen Pirates of the Caribbean? I have. Cool. Oh, let's grab. How close are we to his uh, walls, as it were? 
Oh, they're 50 feet away on either side. You've been, you're like pretty much banging the center of where he emerged, unfortunately. Shit's a brick. Yeah. Okay. Um... Uh, you can see, uh, falling <clears throat> beneath you, a fair bit of debris from the city. You appear to have been, uh, luckily, towards the top of the debris, and the majority of the paved stones and other inhabitants of the mm. city and houses mm. are all beneath you. So at least you're not going to get flattened by debris when you hit the, the acid, as it were. Anything soft there? Uh, in the remains of a city? Yeah. There might be a bed, mattress. <coughs> yeah. Uh... bodies. It's 850 feet. Damn, that's, that's a big worm, man. <clears throat> Fucking hell. He's big, man. You don't fuck about. Um... <laughs> What they even fucking say? I don't know. The mattress. Yeah, you can see. Uh, luckily, an entire mattress shop uh, got destroyed oh, yeah. just beneath <laughs> you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, hell yeah. Yeah. Wow. And you actually, it, luckily, it was really far. It was a bit underground. It was so far ahead of you. Uh, and you see these mattresses hit the uh, acid, and they just dissolve into nothing. Oh. Oh Yeah, it's kind of rough. Uh, but as you are looking around for anything to help you out, you do notice an enormous chain stretching from what appears to be one side of his stomach to the other. Right, okay. Cool, 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 cool. We grab- uh, the chain? Had- Sorry? Can we grab the chain? At maximum velocity? Well, I'm not- the velocity is not getting right. any slower. So I'm a total, right? Yep. And we get attacked <laughs> by great eagles pretty regularly. <laughs> My <laughs> that's coming. Yep. My my entire village got destroyed by great eagles. Yep. Uh, so I, I, I knew I, I knew that I could I, I, if I was to fight great eagles, uh, I would at least be able to to attempt to learn to survive falling from very great heights. <laughs> Being that is the primary method of, of being killed by great eagles. The totals, yeah, yeah just... dude, they tend to just drop you, uh, not into acid normally, but yeah, um, yeah. <clears throat> so, uh, I uh, tuck myself in, make myself into something of a circle using my arms around my shell, and uh, and begin to try and glide using the flat of my shell, and the top of my shell is sort of a wing. Like <laughs> shit, I, I try to, I try and direct myself <clears throat> toward this chain. No, <laughs> um, uh... <laughs> sure. Anyone else got any better ideas? <laughs> uh, I, I, will, uh, yeah. I will wait till I'm approximately within, within thirty feet of the uh, <clears throat> chain, and then just misty step onto onto it. Does that cancel velocity? D- doesn't say. I teleport 30 feet to an unoccupied space. Sounds like it would. <sighs> Does it, though? Yes. Come on, Thomas. Yeah, uh, yeah, people yeah. like Misty Step, they take a fall and then Misty Step back up to the top. Uh, uh, you know what? Sure. Ben has managed to Misty Step onto the chain. <laughs> Okay. Mr. Good. DM, That's how me. many handkerchiefs do you think I have to pull out of my sleeve to make a parachute? Um. Ooh, how big is that handkerchief? Uh, like a foot by a foot. Oh, do they come out sewn together in a perfect parachute shape? Would we say, or mm. Mm. they certainly come out sewn together? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, but like, are they parachute shaped or are they just in a rope shape as they've been used previously? A lot of them individually in parachute shapes. So, no. I think uh, you could maybe use it as a lasso to try and lasso uh, tingle toes to come down with you. Hang myself before (laughs) I fall to death. Hmm. Okay, so it'll die immediately. That's fine. Um, I would like to just go into wild shape and take the um hey. shape 
a giant owl. Nice. He's a... I mean, you can catch us all. Um, how big wow. is a giant ah, owl? I just want to say that roll is staggeringly low. <clears throat> yeah, <laughs> staggeringly low. Twenty d six. Wow. And he consistently rolled like below average. I would say in that. Yeah. Damn. Right. That's crazy, giant man. Owl, fucking sixty feet. Let's get. All right. Uh, yes, yeah, so you can grab uh, probably at least two people with that as well. Maybe yeah. more. How big is a giant owl, actually? I'm fucking looking at it. Um, okay. A large creature? Uh, can I cast Enlarge on Obo when she's in L4? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <watch out. laughs> yeah, yeah, I cast Enlarge on Obo so she becomes <clears throat> double the size and double the weight. Right, I'm a big owl. Oh god, I start. <laughs> this is already my worst nightmare. <laughs> and then I see the giant owl. Yeah, I like swoop down, um, maybe grab one or two in my claws. Uh, who would you like to save? Um, well, I've got a plan to save everyone, whether it works out or not. Okay, hit me with it. Who are the two closest to me? Um, well, let's think who was next to you on that map. I it suppose wasn't... it was Mer- it was Meritrix. Okay. Yeah, well, Piz isn't even on that map anymore. Piz is like didn't even walk with the party towards that room. Yeah, I maintain uh, Piz just like throwing random shit from the bag into lime just to see what would happen. It was all just dissolving yeah, on I contact for reference. Than they fall. Uh, yeah, you you mean you're now a larger, heavier creature, so you can okay. fall faster than them regardless. So Meritrix and Barry are your two nearest compatriots since Vincenzo right. has teleported away. I'll grab Meza and Baz. Meza? Meza. Meza. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I like that. <laughs> and I'll uh, fucking <laughs> scoop them down. I'm literally paralyzed with fear. Like, all this other stuff I can handle, but but I'm, I'm full on having flashbacks to my family being then... cast against the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> I retreat to shell. Um, sweep under uh, shit, fuck, piss. Upon my giant feathered soft back. Okay, I like it. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> just for reference, Great Eagles did kill uh, Barry's. I think no. entire yeah. town. Yes. Look, well, he can panic all he wants, but he's not dead. So. No, I'm in my shell now. I'm, I'm, I'm just. I've gone to my quiet place. A hyperventilating in your shell. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I like yeah. it. I like it. Ten minutes until he suffocates. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. All right. If he, well. if he thinks that Obo is a is an eagle, it means he's a racist. <laughs> <laughs> I think Barry's been pretty open about being a racist. <laughs> <laughs> Right, well, you know what? Um, you have forgotten one party member. Laocene is still plumbing into his oh. death while shitting himself. <laughs> fucking classic thing. <laughs> I'll leave it be. Well, maybe Laocene should have deep throat in that fucking tooth. <laughs> He's already had one character fucking gone. <laughs> we can't. Let's, can we just say he wasn't in the church with us, or like we left him at the I, or something? I'm gonna. That involves splitting the party to an unbelievable extent. Right, I can save him. I save him. Yeah, you just save him. It's fine. Yeah, you just saved him. It's fine. I grow. I grow another <laughs> spell slot. Can we? Falling. Can we say he was like on the edge of the church that like didn't get swallowed or something? I don't know. He's because like you, on the you, edge you, of this <laughs> hole. He's on the edge just, of the hole. Are inside of a giant worm. If Finny <laughs> isn't inside of that with you, what is he doing? <laughs> well, like he's he maybe got, he got knocked yeah. back. You know, the worm came up <laughs> and he got I'm knocked also, back. I've decided I've got feather falling, and uh, I cast that. <laughs> Great, sweet. <laughs> so you all managed to successfully. I do have feather not... falling. I just didn't have right. it uh, prepared. The reason that he shit himself and is doing so poorly, he's been living in Barry's shell for the last week. <laughs> okay. He currently is in my shell. Yeah, take it back when it's fine. 
<laughs> He's inside Barry's shell. Okay, that works. Oh my god. Along with Barry, who's quivering in yeah. fear. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm just holding him. <laughs> He's still vomiting and shitting himself. So. Do I, get, I, um, I don't care. Do I get advantage <laughs> on wisdom throws when I'm an owl? You do, yeah. yeah, you do. <laughs> What's the relevance of that right now? We're in a hole. Yeah, it's just good to know, you know. I will okay. never fly at night, mate. <laughs> oh. uh, so the part of your ones upon the chain. I thought we were on an owl. You were <laughs> on an owl inside a great spirit, plummeting to your death <laughs> as multiple members of the party landed on the chain. Bro, As why is there into an owl in here? <laughs> because you he's oh, just yeah, eating the a city. city. <laughs> <laughs> also, bro, why is there a house in there? Go investigate. I don't need sleep. I need answers. <laughs> Why is there a fucking house down here? Tom, can you find a picture of a giant owl so I can roleplay better, please? Uh, absolutely. Are you staying in giant, uh, giant owl form? You yeah, only stay double size for one minute. Uh, that's fine, so but I can stay in beast form for two hours, so I would like to, I would like to stay as an owl. Oh, two God. fucking yeah. hours! <laughs> can, <have> a picture. <laughs> can you still talk or you can only <laughs> um, Let's go with a second. Oh, you can only hoot now. Oh, good luck. Does anyone have speak with animals? I'll Thank hoot God. in like syllables, and maybe you'll be able to understand. <laughs> what does that mean? It's about as intelligible. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, oh excitement. I need a piss. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. How are we going to get out of this chip? <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, this, uh... Yeah, this is where I hoped the session would go, to be fair. Mm, mm, mm. I, I want to point out, exactly two hours after we started the <laughs> session, you guys were on top of where he was summoned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. perfectly yeah. on top. And you did roll the two out of ten last session as well, Rian. So thank you for that. Yeah, yeah. So it's mainly Rian's fault. Yeah, so it's my god, you know. Uh, roll the punches sometimes. Yeah. <clears throat> I feel a strange sense of glee. I think at being inside a barn. Uh... <laughs> so I'm finally at peace. Yeah, I do. I kind of feel whole again. Um. Feel like. Speaking of hole, uh, how thick is Boren's <laughs> oh, yeah. wall? Yeah, how thick is Boren? Oh, Eleven foot. <laughs> oh no, shall we say ten foot and one inch? Just, just perfectly uh, too large for your bullshit. <laughs> 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 is the bag of holding still really big? Did that? Did that even happen? <laughs> um, I don't know. Or did we agree it was a terrible idea? Like that. I thought it was fucking genius. Oh, I thought right. it was alright. Well, pissed it at least. Well, certain death by astral plane, or probable death by demon, <clears throat> well, the spirit of death, you know? The thing right. is, if we, do, right, if we carve out a Boron, I don't even think he's gonna... But, aren't you a bird? Can't we just fly out? Oh, shit. Can't we just all jump on your back and fly out of here? Do I... we have a look at the house first? I suppose we could. Yeah, let's let's investigate the house first because I, I am also into, curious. Getting into precious <laughs> owl be, time. There could be the literal incarnation of death in here. That'd be pre- that'd, that'd be pretty cool to me. Flowers <laughs> <laughs> owl time, man. Do you need to real slow? Okay, can we just can we just walk across this train? Are we good? Just come on here. Well, yeah. well I have to uh, go across because I'm an owl. Irish owl, by the way. Yeah, brother, where's my owl? I can't. There. Oh, you can add to your permission. I just put it down. That's a pretty chill owl. Yeah. I like this owl. Did oh, you make this the... owl? No, I found it on the internet. Okay. <laughs> Did you look uh, for reference, I, I actually yeah. looked up hot sexy owl and that came up. <laughs> uh, it, it looked like that. Oh yeah, I was going to say, wow. can we have a big owl? Right. <laughs> yeah, you can be like that big around. There you go. Yeah, you. I, I mainly want to get 
Get in the house because I want to get away from that fucking owl. <laughs> yeah, Obo is a terrifying barrier I, right now. I, I know it's Obo, but it's real. No, I'm in. I'm in. I'm inside. <laughs> right, uh, Barry rudely burst into the house. Can At which not... point, I need to find a picture of the thing. But oh, um... I'm sitting on top of the house. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I'm shitting into the hole. Wait, have you got a landline? You mean the, the chimney? <laughs> no chimney. The the hole. Hole. <laughs> you you the Fucking animal. <laughs> You're shitting on the house. Uh, in I'd the like house. To, no, I'd like to delay the shitting until we know what's in the house, actually. I feel like that could spell like that. <laughs> How are you going to know how the way you're an owl on the roof? I'm still over. <laughs> you got sewer plague now as well. Oh. <laughs> I mean, Boren might have it at this point with the fucking <laughs> shit he's been eating. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he's not this big, but he's a goblin. Oh, oh, the fucking goblin. Fucking goblin. goblin. Yeah, he wakes up and goes, "Oh, oh!" That's oh, a fucking hello, Ich bin Barry. <laughs> 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 Shit, I forgot you spoke goblin. Fuck. That's the level of a two year old. I can well, barely understand him. It's gonna go, oh, hello? Hello, ich, ich bin Barry, ja. Oh, hello. Ich heiße Jonah. Hello, ich heiße Barry. Uh, wie geht's du? <laughs> ja. <laughs> oh. What? <laughs> uh, I'm the Totfei. Aber ich sprechen Sie kommen? Ja, I, a kleine. <laughs> kleine? Hello, yeah. do you speak common? Oh, uh, yeah, I fucking speak common, please. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Hello there, <laughs> visitors. I love visitors, yeah. Why is Jonas so big? <laughs> Jonah is big boy. Jonah will be small now. <laughs> it was I thought he may also be a half orc, half goblin, but just in the opposite way. Than no, I Jonah <laughs> is goblin all the way down. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh no. Uh, goblin see, goblin do. Maybe we survive all this acid shit. Same way as you. Yeah. The you chain. Your friend turned into a big owl, owl and thought you want a chain? That's a weird coincidence. Oh, well, I was asleep. I assume you just grabbed the chain. Yeah, no? we grabbed the chain. Oh, wow. Well, so few words. Has enough. he seen me yet? Uh, no, he's not, actually, no. <laughs> you do that owl thing where you turn your head 180 degrees. <laughs> Give him a spook. <laughs> yeah, Why don't you make him aware of you being there, Ryan? Because a nice little owl hoot. I'm doing it in so 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 high that my mic can't pick it up. <laughs> that, was, that was absolute silence. Oh, yeah. oh, oh my god! Uh, <laughs> that nine, please, master, save me. He's gonna cower in fear from the enormous owl. It's fine. Yeah. It's a friend. Oh, Just thank friend. you, master. You saved me. No, no, you you were in no danger. Oh, thank you anyway, master. Uh, cheers. Bye. No worries. What brings masters to the belly? Uh, oh, we're just sightseeing. <laughs> sightseeing? <laughs> <laughs> no, we were fucking eating you in here. <laughs> oh, sorry, master. He, uh, he cowers and begs for forgiveness from Meritrix. <laughs> I didn't mean to offend, yeah. Jonah, mate. Where, mm. where did this attitude come yes, from? Yes, master. <clears throat> Why are you well, calling us master? Well, master knows that Jonah is a measly servant. To who? Who are you a bloody measly servant to? But Jonah must live in this house and greet the new arrivals, yeah. New arrivals? Yeah. 
So there's more of us down here. Yeah. And, and, you know, and where where do they go? At least I'm in Dreisig of you, yeah. Can I ask him a question? Oh, thir- oh yes. thirteen. <laughs> uh, yeah, master. Whatever you say, master. Does the owl have a question for me? Can I ask? Can I ask him a? Ooh, his master is Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Fuck you. <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> but I will give you inspiration for that, Rianne. So Thank good job. <laughs> terrible though. Uh, I refuse to answer in character. Um, she said, who's your master? Everyone is, yeah. Everyone? All Jonah right. is merely the greeter. What if I tell you not to be a greeter anymore, Jonah? Why don't you come with us? Yeah, okay, master. Now, where do you send them, people who arrive here? Well, there's, there's two options, master. What is your opinion of Morrand? Think is that a trick question? About your answer, Barry. <laughs> no, I will just allocate you appropriately, are uh, and very efficient. Well, he's the bloody god of death, isn't he? Okay. And um, we're all we're all living. So no, I'm I'm not not a not the biggest fan. Yeah. Hmm. What do you think of being trapped inside of him? Well, I'd quite like to get out, personally. Oh, an escapist, I see. I'll have a go. Anyone else? Yeah, we want to get out. Uh, ideally out of here, yes. Out? No worshippers of the Great Borrand? Not as far as I remember. Nine. Okay. <laughs> The word is in her kitchen, uh, and also in owl form, so... <laughs> <laughs> ah, I guess that is the German word for zero. <laughs> uh, yeah. if, uh, one amongst us was a worshipper, Barn. Well, that is the second option. There are two major cities, two grosser cities, yeah. Two bergs. In fact, as I remember German words on the fly. <laughs> one that. city. Well, one is higher, one is lower. Ah. The higher city tends to be full of those who worship the great bond. Mm. And the lower city is full of those who despise the infidel bond and wish to escape. So uh, which one are you? Well, Master says and Master knows. Uh, Jonah lives to serve. Uh huh. Yo, I hate this guy. Where, where, where are the rest of the people that want to get out? That would be lower. How do we get there? You must head to the, the opposite side of the chain, yeah. Peace. Hang on, can can I can I repitch the idea? We all just jump on Obo's back and fly I, out of I, here. I already said peace. Oh. <laughs> uh, you notice uh, as you think this Meritrix of the light uh, begins to fail, oh. almost as if he has closed his gullet, oh. and you are now trapped in his stomach. Yeah. Okay, never mind. <laughs> For the lowest it is. You are in the belly of the beast. Yeah. Uh, can, we, can we take Jonah uh, with us? Master Barry, do you wish me to come, Fizz? Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure I can make decisions for the whole group, but tell you what, I'll pop back later and I'll have a cup of tea. I, th- I oh. think we should bring Jonah as leverage. <laughs> you never yeah. know. He what seems like a valuable hostage. Hey, it's the only hostage leverage, we've got. Leverage for what? His it's house. <laughs> you never know. He's the first character we've met that's kind of submissive, so maybe we should take advantage <laughs> of that. 
You what literally found a sex cult. You know what, Jonah? Bend over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're not going there. Uh, we're not going there. Good, good. Tell you what, Jonah, I'll come back when we've when we've settled down in Lower Town. I'll come and say hello. How that road? Okay, Master. I'll see you later, then. Yeah. Uh, I I break off into an autistic sprint to get away from now. <laughs> <laughs> you can head across the chain. Um, I'm over. I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> you, you've yeah, never seen a turtle travel so game. fucking fast. <laughs> oh god, it's coming! Fuck! Jack, it's coming. Okay, see you later, masters. Jonah's so lonely. Uh. He goes back into his house. He was, oh. he was very annoying. I oh, Vincenzo's that. committed. Vincenzo's gone. <laughs> yes. uh, Jonas sent him over the edge. And as you guys uh, make your way across the chain, you know, it's, it's quite a perilous journey across the great sea of stomach acid. It may only be 100 feet, but it is a large distance to travel. And as you look down into the sea beneath you, um, you can occasionally see the bodies from the city that was just demolished above you fall into it, as well as various bits of architecture that you see impact the surface in great splashes of stomach acid. Uh, geysering up at you. Um, you all approach the bottom of the chain. Yes, yeah, this is the last map I've got prepared, so RIP. Uh, me. It'll be taken up from next session. But as you uh, approach the opposite side of the chain, um, you begin to see, uh, off in the distance still, a large city uh, with a, a fair few lights. Maybe not a city. Let's say a large town. Uh, uh, from a distance, it looks rather ramshackle. Um Almost if it's made from the uh, flotsam of what can be found in Boren's belly, rather than a, a planned town, as it were. Um, and as you approach the town, a taller than average dwarf hails you. On than average. Taller Break. than average. Break your uh, What did you say to me? Hello there, good dwarf. Yes, yeah, what I thought. What brings you individuals to my town? Oh, we got eaten by a big fucking worm. Yes, and you chose not to just go die? Well, yeah, that sucks. That's and what brings you here exactly to my town? We want to get out. Oh, you wish to escape, do you? Hell yeah. Yeah. You still got the passion and the flame for it. Uh, recent admissions, I assume, then. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, come on in, then. And he bows and uh, presents, opens the gate and presents you uh, the ramshackle shithole. <laughs> That is the uh, town I have yet to name. <laughs> It'll probably have a intestinal pun, but who knows? I, think uh, and that I, was, all... I was about to be uh, on the spot, but let's not. I think yeah, you should leave not... it as uh, the time you've the town you've yet to name. The town that... that is yet to be named. Yeah, yeah the sure. mayor has not named it yet. <laughs> yeah, that is an unnamed town. They they've not named it because they don't wish to stay. You know, they yeah, wish to exactly. escape. <laughs> it's a temporary house for them, and if they have not named it, boom. And that's what I've got for this week, boys. Hope you enjoyed. Hey. Woo! Yeah, that was yeah, awesome. That's a good slash, man. Good stuff. Sweet. Nice. Uh, a wonderful shit show. Yeah, honestly. I was really wondering how it would be just two hours in. I just go, <laughs> boom, burned, annihilates this particular well, we, spot. We had like a solid 20 minutes trying to decide whether to leave or not. And then we ended up just doing the plot anyway. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I, I'd prepared for you to leave with the fucking holding uh, Chad Hovis hostage uh, with a literal trail of breadcrumbs. Chad. Nice. Yep. Nice. 
That was my only, like, I need to force them into it. Apart from that, I was just like, cool, if they do this, I'll just annihilate the city and they can go on their way. Um, here's my question to the boys. How long would we like the uh, internal Borand arc to last? I don't know. Um, um, was it I'd say not longer than five sessions, but... Jesus! <laughs> that, oh, that's, like, pretty, pretty generous, precise. right? Yeah, it is very precise. That's like maximum, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> it's like twenty twenty three, mate. I, <laughs> I, like I, that. I could make a lot of shit happen, or we can get out of it quick and go back to normal stuff. The people are interested in doing a inside the worm D and D campaign. I think we should see in the new year by es- escaping Orange, so we have oh, all of shit. December in Barren. <laughs> That's like what, <laughs> probably December four or five sessions. So then, twenty twenty three is the. That's actually the only three sessions for reference. Yeah. Yo, what the fuck? That's six weeks away. I'm a gamer. Mm, okay. <clears throat> Shit, Christmas came up pretty quick. Yeah. Better get a job. Christmas, Christmas comes fast, mate. Christmas. 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 That's his wife. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Oh, We're yeah. hiring you, Mip. Huh? Yeah, hey, Jim. We're hiring. If you want a terrible job. <laughs> no, I've uh, I've got one. Thank you, though. I I, I did manage to find one. Oh, be chilling. Excellent. Yeah. Good job, Jim Gamer. Soon Thanks. you shall fund all of one dig. <laughs> oh, forward to that one. <laughs> You've been volunteered. <laughs> it's me, me and Jim. Man. Yep. Do you have a proper? Do you have a proper job too? Yeah, I have a real job. Yeah. Oh, what a fucking oh, loser! Yeah. Can you pay for me? <laughs> uh, <laughs> give me a year or two. <laughs> guys, yeah, guys, come on. Will's gonna have a creative writing degree as well. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know about that. Sorry. I've got to pass this year. It's not Excellent. looking good. So. 